Hi everyone, Linda Israel here. I'm getting my chat opened up. It's not opening up for me this morning, or I guess it's now afternoon. So I'll be with you in just a moment when I see the chat. <laughs> Hopefully we won't have near the technical difficulties that we did on Monday. I checked the speed of download and upload that I have today and it seems to be working a lot better. Oh good, I start to see people. Hey Norella, hey Deanna, dream it, imagine it, create it, so glad you're here. And Ducky, hey, <laughs> hey Debbie, hey Jean, so glad you could be here. So I'm gonna quickly kind of go through the Bella Rose Garden subscription kit so you kind of get an idea, and then we're gonna make some stuff today. Hello Robin, hey Debbie. So. Let me get started. Hercules is in my lap. He's decided that he needs some attention today. You wanna go up there and say hi? You wanna say hi? Come on. Go up there and say hi. Go, go. All right, there's Hercules. He had to say hi because he's being a little bit of a stinker today. He wants to be in my lap continuously. <laughs> hey, Giovanna, so glad you're here. All right, so I'm gonna quickly go through this. The Bella Rose Garden subscription box is $24.99. By the way, if you are watching this replay, down in this lower corner here, I'm gonna get my, my, picture, my figure right, is a gear and you can click on that and you can speed up this video to two times the speed so that you can get through it a little bit faster if this happens to be a really long stream. Hey, Mariana. Hey, Francis. Hey, Jackie. <laughs> yeah, he's a little feisty this today. <laughs> All right, so $24.99. This is available in my shop right now. I am taking orders through February the 10th, and that is when I will submit my order to get the printed material, and it will ship out on February the 15th. You will get a stencil that's valued at... $10.99 or $11 that I created. So this is a look at the image. I hand drew that and then brought it into my cutting software and made a stencil. And here's what it looks like when sprayed through the stencil. And then this is mopping up the stencil. And then we've got all these goodies here. So I'll kind of start with this on top here. Yay, I'm so glad you're here, Louis. This is your first live. I thought I would do some early in the day. So you get a yard of this little fuzzy yarn, a yard of sequin trim. It's kind of iridescent, I love it. You'll also get this fuzzy white yarn. It's kind of bumpy. You'll get a little piece of random. It'll either be pink or pink to gray, kind of a burgundy color. You'll get a yard of this pink lace and a yard of white lace, a yard of this string that has little sparkles in it. You'll get a little chiffon rose. You'll also get little pieces of pink paper. Also in this kit is a bunch of buttons and little paper flowers and sequins and charms. Lots of little goodies in there. I've got some close-up photos, or I got a photo on my website. So those will be in there as well. You'll also get like doilies and paper sacks and corrugated cardboard and chip or craft board, ivory, some watercolor paper, some white journal cards, a little file folder. You'll get a little ticket that you can embellish. This is chalk paper that you can write on with chalk or you can use a gel pen. I love the pink. I'm glad you like it. it it's a wonderful kit. Yay. Hey, Patricia. Good, good to have you here from Alls. <laughs> and hello, Francis. <laughs> this is some craft paper. More craft. This is uh, what I call cardstock weight. Some more craft. Some bigger craft pieces. And then you get a pretty pink envelope. You get a napkin and another a larger envelope. And this is kind of like some pink parchment paper. You'll get 
this hymnal, which is actually, if you tear it apart, you get two pieces or you can leave it as a whole piece. You'll get a couple of pages out of a Bible, a couple of pages out of a dictionary. Wait, but there's more! <laughs> You'll also get, exclusive to this kit, three fussy cut ephemera pages. So here is the first one with the corner pocket and little bits that you can use like this can be a journaling card that can be a journaling card or a belly band and whenever it says friendly in the kit that's a nod to the friendly junk journal people and if you see a date in the kit that is the day that norella and i met in person so this is a word search another journal card some more journal card bits and pieces and then here is Another fussy cut page. I love the robin and the butterfly in the dress form. And then in this kit is a physical ready-made journal. It is made of 100 pound cardstock cover that is eight and a half by five and a half. And it has 12 pages inside. They're beautiful made. These are designed by Norella of Calico Collage. The center, you can remove the staples and then add more pages. I know the word search is really cool, I think. I, I thought it was really neat. So let me put this away and then I'll show you one of the journals I made in the live stream the other day. I'm gonna, put this, I'm gonna keep the stencil out because we'll use it. But I'm gonna put this away because this is my share the kit well if i can manage it it's easier said than done i think norella did an option a uh, great op great great job on this hey austin so glad to see you here all right i'm having problems yeah it's been real okay really seriously come on I know it's been really cold across the United States. It was like 29 degrees this morning. And my heater is working like, it's driving me crazy. It's working so well. It's so hot in here. I'm about to die. All right, so here's the journal that I made on Monday night. Elsie won this journal as part of my raffle giveaway. And I have not adhered the things on the front. I've left it for her. So these are some pieces that I made during the live that she can add when she gets it. But here is the journal cover and one of the journal pages. And then this is how I decorated it. So I thought I would show you what the inside looks like. So we've got, this is a notebook paper that I sprayed through the stencil using the Tattered Angels Glimmer Mist that comes in the kit. So you get this in the kit. It's a $5 value of Tattered Angels Glimmer Mist. Then this is all the ephemera pieces. So I just kind of flip through this really fast. Kentucky's on the upside of warming up. Well, that's good. You 60s this weekend would be awesome. Hey, Laura. Hey, Karen. I'm glad you're liking it. Hey, I'm so glad you could be here. We had 30, minus 37 last night, Robin. That's freaking cold. Wow. I showed how to make this little pocket in the live video on Monday. We had some buffering issues, but the video is up there and you can pretty much watch it. And I love this page, how it turned out. I showed some stamping. So we got a little variety of things that I did. I also have some stamp bundles in my shop. Um, so you can check those out as well. I'm going to put this away so that it doesn't get messed up and Elsie gets it the way I created it. Oh, I'm sorry. You didn't have it three months ago. You would have loved it. Oh, let me show you this really fast. So I have these available in my shop. This is a really nice heavy canvas bag that is, I think it's 10 by 14, and it has a five inch gusset, and it has my name embroidered in my logo on both sides. Thank you so much, Carrie. And then this is a smaller little zipper pouch that is approximately, what I always, I always mess this up. Okay, upside down ruler. 
it is 12 inches by 10 inches so it'd be perfect to put your journal in that you're working on and keep it all nice and neat inside your canvas tote and then Henry helped me make these this is a little junk journal tools zipper pouch that is five and a half by seven and a half and it fits all of my little tools that I use when I'm working on my journal yes please share it you can share this video anywhere you like thank you thank you thank you for sharing it so I wanted to show you those and those are in my shop right now you can buy individually you can buy it as a set so I've had a few people that have already purchased those. Um, and I know I keep showing you stuff that I have to sell, but you know, if I'm going to do this, I need to be able to make some living of uh, selling some of the things and we have a lot of things that are coming up ahead that are going to be a lot of fun. So let's kind of get started here. Um, what I did was I, oh, and we had the printed kit as well, but I went in and used the digital download and I printed some of the pages. I just thought I would show you. So this was printed on my inkjet printer. So it's a matte, um, a little bit different coloring. And then this is on the laser. So it's shiny. So that's what the difference is. But you can see how vivid it is even on your home printer. You can make some beautiful prints. And I thought what I'd do is make kind of a little portfolio thing today. So I'm gonna, Hercules is trying to get on the desk again. <laughs> um, I do have some prizes that we're going to give away. Oh, oh, you did. That's cool, Carrie. You dyed yours purple. That's awesome. <laughs> Hercules just wants to be in the middle of everything. Hey, Jennifer. <laughs> I decided just to come on live, Elsie. Um, I just showed your journal. I don't know if you saw it, but you can see it in the, the replay. And I need to find out, do you want me to go ahead and finish decorating the cover? Or you just want to put those things on yourself so I can do that? Um, let's see. You know, I, I don't know if I'll use a napkin today in the journal, but I'll use a napkin. How's that sound? I may go grab one. And I can use a napkin. Today, what I'm going to do is kind of make a little portfolio thing. So I've got the images printed out on cardstock here. And I'm going to fold this. And this is going to be my portfolio cover, if you will. And let me see how we're going to decorate this today. I did pre-cut a few things. I haven't cut this out yet. Oh, and another thing that I'm going to start having in my shop, if y'all are interested. I've had a lot of people ask about these um, garment pins, uh, bulb pins. I'm gonna start selling a set of 25 for $5 in my shop. I'm also getting another color. They should be arriving today, so I can put that on there. Hey, Erin, hey, Luna. So glad to have you here, glad you're here. So just so y'all know that this is, uh, I'm using a streaming software, so that's why you get to see the video within video. I'm also having some things that'll pop up from Junkie Joe. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask. Be glad to help you. Hey, girl on the ridge, so glad you're here. I feel honored. I don't see you very often. I know you're busy. Um, so thanks for being here. I am gonna have a giveaway, so we're gonna start a raffle here in just a moment. Let me get that going. So I'm gonna do a giveaway. And I'm going to give away some, let's, let's start with this. We're going to give away some glue dots. So I've got a little package or two. Let me see if I've got any more. We'll just do, do we want to individual? We'll do individual. So the first giveaway is going to be for this package of glue dots. So I'm going to put glue dots. And it'll be open for everyone. And then that's what you will type. All right. So you'll put, these are black. The ones I have right now are black and I'm getting ready to get some gold ones. So type in exclamation point raffle and you can get into the raffle for some glue dots. And then once I close that in a couple of minutes, I'll do some more. I've got some more goodies here that I am gonna give away. I'm gonna give away some hemp cord. I've also got, an ephemera pack of goodies that I have and then I have some cool things where you can add a video to your journal by using a QR code so put in raffle 
to win. I'm going to set this aside for a moment. I'm going to go ahead and trim my page here. Get in her to win. Yes, type exclamation point raffle for a chance to win. So Henry had been talking to me about going live on Thursday, and I had intended to go live a little bit earlier, but I was working on my computer and trying to get a few things done beforehand. Mostly that was printing the items that I wanted to use for today and fussy cutting the items I did with my silhouette software. Um, if y'all don't know that when you have the digital download, you can bring those image into your electronic cutter software and use their features to print and cut. And that's what I did with the items that I'm sharing today. I used my, excuse me, my silhouette to cut all the pieces. All right, is everybody in the raffle? Is everybody getting entered into the raffle as I cut out? I usually have everything cut, but this is I hadn't finished yet. Glad you're here. Glad you're here. I love these papers. They're part of the Bella Rose garden that Norella created. So you can see it says exclusive Bella Rose garden by Calico Collage. Hey, Tammy. Glad you're here. I have put the Bella Rose subscription box in my shop. There are only 100 kits total available. If I sell out before January the 10th, that means everybody might get their order earlier <laughs> because I'll be able to submit the order. But if uh, you wait, you can wait till January the 10th and then the whole order will be shipped out on February, it's not January the 10th, Feb, January, February the 10th. And it'll be shipped out on February the um, 15th. So now what I'm doing, I'm trying to decide how I want to put this together on the inside. And I think I want it to be kind of like a, a booklet that you can put things in. So what I'm going to do is look for another piece of paper here. I think what I want to do, let me grab a piece of cardstock from up here. No, I have some. Oh, here we go. We'll make some pockets. We'll make some pockets. The slogan, it's raffle time. <laughs> yeah, if you haven't, hello, Erica. If you haven't entered the raffle, enter the raffle. And then I will draw here in just a moment. I'm going to eat a pretzel. I'll have one in my drawer. <laughs> All right. Let's spray. I'm going to use this Tattered Angels Glimmer Mist. We got our laser in. I tried to use it yesterday and it wasn't working. So I got frustrated after four hours instead of going home. Watched a bunch of tutorial videos last night. And I think I've got it figured out. So as soon as I get off here with you guys and gals, I'll go up to the shop and mess with the laser. So now what I'm doing is I'm spraying this with the Bella Rose Pink. I, I haven't decided what the name's going to be, but a Bella Rose Pink is what I want to call it uh, on the back of the stencil. And then I'm going to use this cardstock and mop it up on the other side. Yay! I'm so glad, Tammy, that you like this kit. Hello, Phyllis! Hello, Erin! Is everybody getting in? Yeah, I'm not, I have problems sometimes getting things back in packages. Isn't that kind of cool, the way that looks? All right, so here's the cardstock. So I think what I'm going to do is we're going to make some little pockets out of this. I'm going to cut it. I know this is already going to be tall enough for the page. And I think I'm going to have pockets that go this way. So what I'll do is I'm going to cut this to be about two and a half inches. So I'm going to cut two strips at two and a half inches. Okay. 
Okay. Yeah, so I'm using the paper that I this I'm using it today. That's what I'm going to wipe up with is cardstock. So I'm going to use that. Oh, thank you. I'm glad you like the stamp bundles. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Austin, what I did was I have a video that I need to edit that will show me walking through their booth. And then I have like a little folio thing I'll try to take pictures of and put on the video as well. They have a ton, ton of art Bible stamps that you can use for journaling. It's really cool. Wow, that's a light night. Stay up till 4 a.m. to play with the kit. <laughs> If I don't see your message, I'm sorry. So it's kind of hard. The chat goes really fast. So if I'm looking down, making something, I don't see it. All right. Is everybody entered in the first uh, raffle? Everybody entered? I'm going to glue this down here in just a moment, I think. And we're going to do the first raffle. So I want to keep y'all going. Now, if you donate any dollar amount whatsoever, then I'm going to have a raffle for this little portfolio at the end. So if you're wanting to win this portfolio, any donation made through that dollar sign that you see down below the chat, you can donate any dollar. And I'll put this in the raffle for you guys to hopefully win. All right, is everybody in the raffle? I'm glad. I'm glad you're enjoying it. All right. So hello, hello, hello. Enter the raffle exclamation point raffle i'm gonna draw it as soon as i get this all put together on the first part so what do you think we put it like this and like that and then we have pockets here and here and we can decorate it too but i just want to go ahead and get that on there raffle 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 thank you so much for the donation thank you all right so Let's glue this down. So I'm going to take my Aline's Tacky Glue. And this is still kind of wet, so I'm going to dry it. Because sometimes if it's dry, wet, it kind of has a tendency to have a mind of its own. So I'm going to dry this a little bit. You know, <coughs> pardon me, <coughs> Austin, I am considering putting the cut files, if I can figure out how to make them and share them. Um, some of the cut files, because I use Cricut images, they may have a problem of being able to share those. Um, but I may, on the ones that I, that I physically draw myself, I'll see if I can't figure out a way to do those. It's just one more thing. <laughs> you, you guys and gals don't know how busy I stay. Uh, you know that I, I don't just, um, I don't just sit around all day watching videos or TV and twiddling my thumbs. I am constantly busy. <laughs> hey, Henry, I'm glad you stopped by for a moment. All right, let's see. Um, let's glue this down now. Oh yeah, let's do the raffle. I'm going to do the first raffle. Yeah, one more thing to my to-do list. <laughs> in, in addition to learning how to use our new laser engraver. All right, so let's do the first giveaway. So I'm going to pick a winner. And that first person is going to win the glue dots. So I've got to make a note here of who the winner was. So I'm getting me a pen. <coughs> thank you, Mariana, for the donation. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All uh, right, Erica Nelson. How funny. You've won quite a butt, bunch here recently. So, Erica, you won the glue dots. Erica. Erica won the glue dots. Woohoo, Erica! All right, Erica. So, Erica won the glue dots, and I have her address, so that won't be a problem for me to get this to her. All right, I'm going to open the giveaway again thank you ellen for your donation thank you thank you thank you thank you you are so lucky erica that's awesome all right so i'm gonna do 
the um thank you laura i didn't see your donation thank you so very much okay so i'm going to go do another giveaway we're going to give away this hemp cord thank you laura thank you thank you thank you all right so we're going to all right reset yes and we're going to change this it's going to be the um rainbow thank you so much erica rainbow hemp cord all right so i'm going to open the giveaway for the rainbow hemp cord okay so again I'm gonna, we're going to keep doing this throughout this whole giveaway until i've given away all these goodies so exclamation point raffle to enter the giveaway set that aside we're just like a circus act going on here all these rings are going round and round and round <laughs> all right so i'm going to glue this down on the inside and i want it to be a pocket so that things can go in here so i'm going to put glue on three sides everybody get entered Enter the raffle win something random for me just for being here in february your box that you guys are earning i'll have it set up where you can win or use your bucks to get prizes or things that i offer oh thank you so much elsie i'm glad <clears throat> You're welcome, Phyllis. I'm trying to, you know, share and and encourage and inspire and give things that you and guys and gals can use. All right, so I've just glued this on one side right here. And we'll decorate it some more in just a moment, but I just want to get that glued down. I'm going to do the other side. So make sure you're doing the raffle. Raffle. Let's see, am I missing anybody else? Oh, thank you so much, Tammy, for saying that. You're so sweet. You know, I know I show things that I'm selling, but, you know, look at what I'm doing and think about what do you already own that you can use? Yes, I want you to buy some things to help me be able to continue showing, but if you don't have the funds to order, think about what you already own and how you can decorate things that you have with the things in your stash right now. Or maybe you only need to buy a couple of things in order to be able to decorate and make cool things. All right, so let's see here. I think what I'm gonna do is, this is kind of a belly band. So I'm going to place it on here, on top, and we'll have a piece that's cut off. So let me see how I want to do this. If I want to start from here and cut it, I think, right about there. So I'm trying not to cut off the key. So I'm lining it up with this side, and I'm going to cut it. And this was part of the digital download that you can choose to order the whole subscription box and add on the digital download. Or for those of you that only want the digital download, maybe it's too expensive to ship to you, you can order the digital download for $14.99. It's a subscription. Again, with my subscription box, you can opt out at any time. So all it does is just kind of puts a placeholder so I know how many kits to make. So if you can't continue the next uh, time, just go in and change through your my account or send me a message and I can put yours on hold and I understand I totally do so don't feel sheepish about coming to me and saying Linda I can't afford it this month or you know I need to wait because if something's going on just say hey can you put it on hold and I'll do that for you all right I think I'm gonna put this right here on top what do you think <clears throat> um let's see uh oh, <laughs> my needle went on vacation once. Yeah, that happened the other day. 
You were trying to figure out how to mop up. <laughs> Oh, lots of beads. Oh, no. I hate it when I drop those. Oh, no. <laughs> oh. That's terrible. Yes, you can buy through my shop. I have a link in the description box. And if you do exclamation point webpage, it'll show you my webpage and you can go to my shop there. Oh, yeah, you know, a brayer might be good, Elsie. Then you don't get your fingers dirty. So this one I'm using uh, cardstock at the moment. When I do my pages, I'll use text weight. All right, so let's glue this down. So I'm going to add a little bit of glue right here at the top and here. Did everybody get entered into the current raffle? Did you get entered into the raffle? I think my camera is tilted. Let's see if I can fix this just a little bit. Oops, going for a ride. All right. I don't know why it was tilted. I guess I moved it. All right, what else am I missing? They all come together, Sandra, so we can save on shipping. So if you order a subscription box and you realize after the fact that you want extra items just let me know and i'll help you make sure that you don't get charged shipping on the additional order and all of it will be shipped together did y'all get entered into the raffle i want to make sure so text weight paper julie is what i call copy paper um let me get it out so this is, I bought a whole bunch of this before we sold our insurance agency. So mine is just really cheap, uh, 20 pound, comes 500 sheets of 96 Bright. This was from Staples. And that is the thin, the really thin paper, really, really thin paper. Okay. That would be copy paper or text weight paper. You're welcome. Hey, Mandy, so glad you're here. Did everybody get entered to the raffle? <clears throat> Anybody get entered into the raffle? Okay, so I've got, are we about ready? Oh, cool, Bootsy, I bet you that's beautiful. Yeah, um, if, if you have any questions and you go to my website, I have a chat bot there. If I'm, of course, live here, I can't chat with you there. But when I'm at my computer and it rings like a telephone, I answer the chat messages so that I can help anybody that goes to my shop. Did I give this enough room? It may not work. Okay, there, it did work. Okay. I don't want to glue it in yet, but... I'm testing it, but it could also go right here. So you could really stick a lot of things in there. All right, so let's kind of, I'm gonna decorate the outside and we're gonna add some more journal cards to the inside. Hey, Rachel, what you doing, girl? Hey, Neppy, how are you? I'm so glad you're here. Hey, Green Kim Greenleaf. Oh, uh, Rachel is on Calico Collage's design team, and she agreed to make the Bella Rose kit for me and Norella. So you'll get to see another take on how this kit is put together. If y'all didn't know, I'm also helping Just Penny. Did anybody message Just Penny and let her know I'm online? Um that she's doing an online retreat, a junk journal retreat that starts in February. I think the registration is only $10 and you get all these videos and tutorials and you get discount codes um, so that you can buy from all the vendors that are there. 
And I think she's also looking for some more vendors. So if you're a vendor, Norella, if you're still here, you might contact Just Penny and let her know how you can be a sponsor for something or give her a discount code for those that go to the retreat. So you want to check that out. I shared it on my Facebook page. And after I get off the video, I'll try to put it in the description box below. All right, so this is kind of where I'm getting started so far. Are we ready to do the raffle now? I'm gonna do the raffle and then we'll do another one in just a moment. So give away, oh wait, make sure no one's asking. Yeah, make sure to drop her a note. Yeah, do that. How do you get the, this is right here. I've got uh, the download that just came up where you could go to my blog, The Art Bar. Um, the web page is lindaisrael.com and that's my blog and you can go to the uh, products and look at those. Yeah, I was having buffering issues Monday, but it's better now. Okay, thank you, Ellen. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <clears throat> oh yeah, I'm gonna see. I need to... All right, sorry, I got distracted there. <laughs> All right, so let's look at this. When I printed these images, this is the difference between best and economy on my printer. I didn't pay attention and so it printed different things, but I thought it might be kind of neat to have them layered, if you will. So that's why I went ahead and used them. So let's see what we can do to make something neat on this cover and also give some places to tuck things. Hey! Day All right, Dan, okay. <laughs> Not me, Linda. Okay. <laughs> oh, dear. Hey, Angelica. Oh, okay, so if you've got a sinus headache, here's a couple of ideas for you. Number one, do you know what a neti pot is? Get a neti pot. It's not pleasant. You put a salt saline in it and you put it in your nostril and it goes through the other side. It will help you tremendously. Other things to do is if you've got peppermint oil, um, organic is best, maybe something like from Young Living. Put just a drop in the palm of your, a drop in the palm of your hand, and then take it to your, rub them together, rub your hands together, and then t cup your face and breathe in, and that should help open you up as well. You could use wintergreen and peppermint oil. You can also use lavender, that kind of helps with that as well. And then what I like to do is I will put a heat press on my face for like 10 minutes, take it off, and then I'll put ice on my face. And that usually reduces the swelling in your sinuses and help it go away. Hope that is a, something that helps you. <laughs> <clears throat> um, let's see. You love this kit, Francis. Thank you so much. Yes, hot water and breathing in hot water. Yes. Yes, Nikki. If you go in and do the digital download, when you click buy, it will give you the prompts to download it. It's instant. I have the files already uploaded and it should work immediately. If it doesn't, it takes me a few minutes to see the order and I can give you permissions, but it normally works perfect. You're very welcome, Erin. You're very welcome, Nikki. All right. Yeah, breathing in the steam in your shower also helps. Okay, so I think what I want to do is I'm going to do some mixed media stuff here. So those of y'all that don't know, I have in my shop the stamp bundle that is $29.99. And I think it would look kind of cool if I stamp these diamonds on here. So I'm going to get my block. I don't know if it'll fit on this one. Yeah. So I'll get my little block here. I think I need to clean it. Get my tray. 
All right, let's see if we can make a big mess because I'm good at that, y'all. A towel, too. What was the update from Henry? I didn't see it. <laughs> I'm here, Penny says. Um, I think, give me just a moment, Penny, and I think I can make you a moderator over my video. Hopefully I don't mess this up. Okay, let's go to the video. Open in a new link. All right, I'm still with you. <clears throat> I'm waiting for the chat to load because I need to make Penny an administrator so she can share her... Um... Oh, good. I made her an admin. All right. And I was looking for someone else. Do, 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 do. Rachel, where are you? Rachel, I'm looking for you. There you are. And as a moderator. Okay, so I added a couple of people as moderator. All right, so let me close this. All right. All right, it shouldn't be buffering now. I had to open a page and it shouldn't be doing anymore. All right, so. Are we ready to do the raffle? I'm going to get the raffle. Penny, get into the raffle. Penny, get in the raffle. Type exclamation point raffle. I see you, Rachel. You're not an admin, so you can post links. Yeah, I have to manually add them to be administrator. All right, so I'm going to pick the winner. So let me go to giveaway and let's pick a winner. And this winner is getting the hemp cord. And Art Madizar, you won. Did you see Art Marty Azar? She got it. Yay. Come on. You're welcome, Rachel. Hang on a second and we'll do another raffle. Wait, wait, wait. I'm looking for the winner. Because Spectrum Art Martizar, you won. Shh, tell me, say hi. Ah, I can't get it. Congratulations, you won this one. You Spectrum. <clears throat> I'm trying to copy her user ID and it's not allowing me to. Nope, that won't work. All right, has she spoke up yet? Because I need her to contact me. Spectrum! There you go. Thank you for saying that, Tammy. You won! Go ahead and tell me that you won. The name of your cable company? <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> All right. I'll give her a couple of minutes to, oh yes, there she goes. She spoke up. All right, um, Spectrum, contact me. You can do it through my Facebook page. So if I go, you can contact me through my Facebook page. The link should post here in just a second. Um, or you can message me through my, face, my website, um, which is, Hello! That should come up here in just a moment. Come on! Exclamation point web page and exclamation point. Okay, um, so you can go to my web page and send me a message there. Okay, I don't, I don't know why there's a lag today, <clears throat> but I did close out of the other. Let's see. Maybe it'll get better here in just a second. 
All right. Well, I saw that she won. She spoke up. So I'm going to write her name down on my list that I've now misplaced. There it is. All right. Spectrum Art Maddie as Z A R. Okay, yeah, make sure you message me. Okay, Spectrum. All right, I'm going to click and we're going to reset. And she's going to get the rainbow. All right, she's going to get the rainbow hemp. So I'm setting that aside. So the next person is going to get some glue dots. So I'm going to reset and I'm going to change this to glue dots and open giveaway so you can enter the raffle again and this person will win okay nikki i will check to see if i have to change something in order for you to be able to purchase i'll do that when i get off the live feed it should work but sometimes you know technology it's quirky Sometimes I feed Henry lunch, Ellen. Um, today I did it because I was home. <laughs> oh, dear. And Henry has to come, come up with his own. Sometimes I go down the street. We have a taco truck, and I'll go down the street and order tacos. All right, so here's what I want to do. I've got some acrylic paint. So I've got a little pink here. It's kind of a bubblegum pink. And then I've got a paler pink. see if I can get this. I think my paint is old. That'll be good to use up this paint that I've had forever. I got a blob and I got paint all over my hands. Oh, you did. That's funny, Art Bar. You already got some, you got some glue dots today. Yes, I did see Nikki about New Zealand. I'll have to add it to my shop. Um, I thought it was on there. Yeah, poor Henry. He's wasting away. He did eat breakfast. He cooked it while I was busy on my computer. <laughs> so he did eat breakfast. I know he ate that. All right, so I'm just going to mix some of this paint together. And I'm spreading it on my palette here. This is going to become my stamp pad, if that makes sense. Okay, so I'm just kind of mixing a little bit of paint here and get rid of this for a moment. And I'm going to take my stamp. It's on clean mount and I've got a bucket of water here to my side. So what I'm going to do is kind of pick up the paint here. And I'm okay if it's not perfect because I just want it for some texture. So I'm going to grab a piece of paper. And I think what I'm going to do is we're going to just kind of stamp this going down the edge here. Just to add a little difference on there, don't you think? And then I'm going to put this in my water. <clears throat> so I've got a, a little tub here that I'm putting in the water. And then I've got a rag. So I'm just going to wipe off the excess paint that's on my stamp. You want to do it quickly or your stamp will get crusties on it. But if you wash it pretty quick, then you won't have to worry. So I'm just rubbing this. All right, see, it's already clean. I'm so glad you found me. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna set this aside for a moment. I think that looks kind of cool with that texture on there. What do you think? All right, so I'm going to dry my block. So I have this set aside. So we're going to decorate this some more. Let's see here. I think what I want to do, this is going to go on here. 
And then we need to put some journal cards on here. So I've got a whole stack of journal cards. So I've got a little journal card here, but someone had asked me to show how to use craft color. I think that was Sandra. So here's some craft color and I'm going to help to make this match. I'm going to use my paint and we're going to go around the edges of this. So I'm just going to add just a little bit of texture onto this around the edges and it's going to get on the back side too. So it's going to have this messy look to it. Okay, I'm just, just making it messy and I'll set this aside for a second to dry. <laughs> oh, I understand. That's why my bucket is a small bucket. So it's a little bitty uh, bucket that I have. And I usually try to put it somewhere where I don't knock it over or that things don't fall into it. My problem is, is my heat tool is precariously perched and I've had it drop into things a lot. So that was the diamond bar stamp. So this is what it looks like. It comes unmounted and I have this in a bundle in my shop and that's what I use down the side here. Okay. And then we're going to let this dry for a moment and we're going to add some stamping on top of that. And I think I have some more little journal cards. Oh, I know I have, I've got a bookmark. So I'm going to add some paint to it too, just for continuity so that it kind of goes through the whole kit with the same idea or color. I'm just kind of adding some paint to that, I'm getting it all over me. Oh yeah, I'll be doing some gel press uh, uh, printing pretty soon. I uh, did take a workshop, so I'll be doing some cool things. Thank you so much, the art bar. Um, you know, it's just supposed to be fun and, and just enjoy what you're doing and don't fret about it so much. Hey, Pink Rose. Yeah, I do have a few tutorials on the gel press and I'm gonna have more soon. All right, I did get the, is everybody entered into the next raffle? Is everybody entered? I wanna make sure you're all are entered. Get entered. Yes, Penny, go ahead and you can share the link too so people can get signed up for the junk journal retreat online. Just like, I like the messiness. I don't know, it's just kind of fun. <laughs> what do you think? All right, so there's a couple of craft ones. So I'm going to set this paint aside and let's do some, let me get rid of this piece, I need another piece of scrap paper. This one's covered in paint. All right. All righty. And so what I'm going to do is everything that I make that I put into this little portfolio is going to be part of the giveaway. Did I leave? Oh, you mean on here? The dark line when I was cutting those out? Yes, I went ahead and left that and then I used my distress ink to go around the edges to help fill that in. And that gives it a, a little bit darker line to go all the way around it. Does that answer your question? Yeah, share the link to the retreat. Yeah, I left the dark line. Okay, thank you, Penny. That's the link. All right, so let's see here. What do we want to do next? My paint's almost dry. I'm getting paint all over me. Wiping my hands. Make sure you enter the raffle. I'm trying to leave that so you guys can see it. Guys and gals can see it. So you can win some glue dots. <laughs> I 
All right, I think what I want to do now is we're going to use the garden iron works here and I'm going to use some black ink and I'm going to stamp across the bottom. So I'm just inking this up. You're welcome, Penny. I hope we get a lot of people that sign up for it because there's a lot going on. I've got to finish some videos for it. All right, I'm just stamping this in black ink across the bottom. Oh, good. I'm glad you cut it off so you can see it both ways. There you go. Yeah, it kind of looks like distressing, but it's it was the line that Norella put on it so that when I put it in my electronic cutter, it would find the edge and cut it out. <laughs> so I added that there. And then I'm going to grab... I've made a stamp bundle with these stamps in it. So you'll get the postcard stamps, you'll get the butterfly stamps, you'll get the garden gate stamp, the Bella Rose stamp, that's right here, and the journal stamp. It's normally $57 and I've got it in my shop for $46.99 and you get a thank you gift stamp, it's random, that's in there as well. So I'm going to use the Bella Rose stamp. Let me find my little acrylic block here. And I think I'm going to stamp it in black. So anytime that you have a cling mount stamp that you don't know which direction it is, I always stamp it onto a piece of paper to look at it. I think I want to do it this way. So I'm going to stamp this kind of in the corner like that. So now you have writing space in the center and you can write on the back and it's okay if it's messy. It's part of the charm and I'll put some distress ink on it as well. I think this one, I'm going to add the Bella Rose at the top here and at the bottom like that. Yeah. All righty. So I just stamped those on there. The Bella Rose and the Art Garden Ironworks. I always say that wrong. Ironworks. So I thought that would be kind of neat to put on there. And I'm going to use some Distress ink around there. Yeah, when you leave the line around there, you don't have to add near as much distressing ink to it. Everybody does their distressing a little bit differently. Some people like it super duper dark. Some people just like a little bit added. So I'm just adding a little bit on there. All right. Is everybody entered into the raffle this time again? I'll push that winner here in just a moment. I know we're having a little bit of lag. Oh, good. <laughs> I love it when I get junk mail that I can use. Oh yeah, the Paris ticket. That's a beautiful part, isn't it, Rachel? I'm glad you like it. The stamp bundle, this whole stamp bundle is $46.99. It's normally $57 and you'll get it for $46.99. Does that help? We're trying to make it good. Make it a good retreat. We've got lots of people that are in it. Enter the raffle if you have it. Enter the raffle. Okay, so there's a couple of journal cards that'll go with that. So let's see what else we can do here. Oh yeah, so this is just ivory cardstock, okay? And I'm gonna get, I'm gonna show you how to use the butterfly journal. 
uh, butterfly journal, butterfly collage. One side is cleaner than the other. Okay, I don't think I cleaned my stamp the last time, so I'm gonna clean it. <laughs> Oh, you're you're selling one inch fabric washi tape kits at the retreat. Oh, awesome! That's awesome. Yeah, there's going to be lots of things um, that you're going to want to be a part of the retreat because you're going to get a discount code to my shop, my shop, um, that will give you ten percent off anything you order in my shop. So you definitely want the retreat. It's worth the ten dollars just for that because there's lots of things that I have. So here's what I'm doing. I'm going to ink up the butterflies in the center here. I'm using Victorian velvet. <laughs> well, I'm lucky, Robin. My little doggy, I have a doggy door, so I can make him go out the doggy door. All right, so I'm just going to stamp this on here in the middle. So we get butterflies. Isn't that kind of cool? I'm going to do it again. In case you missed it, inking up the butterfly collage. These are by Beeline Designs. They're located in Mustang, Oklahoma, which is about 10 minutes from me. And I've known the owner for well over 20 years. And she started this business back in the 90s. And when I started selling things in my shop, I approached her and said, um, is it possible that I can still get things from you? And she said, yes. And so I was like, all right, great. So I started buying wholesale from her. And then we've been working on some cool things to do. Right. It doesn't, the, the uh, discount code will work on the subscription boxes. The discount code that you get through the virtual retreat will work on anything in my shop. Okay? And it's a limited amount. And do not share that code if people are not in that, didn't pay for the retreat. They don't get to use the code. And it's an unusual code. So if I see somebody that tries to use it, I'll call you out on it. <laughs> And I know 10% isn't a lot, but it's what I could afford because I still have to, you know, make the stuff myself. So I just added some distress ink to those. What do you think? I mean, isn't that a quick way to dress up a plain piece of paper that you can use? So the retreat is a whole bunch of artists that have gotten together to create tutorials on different things. It's all online. It's going to be in Facebook so that you can log into that group and see it, all the videos. Thank you, Angelica. All right, so let's see. We're getting, we're getting a few things here that we can add. So like I put this here and this here. Or maybe I'll put this one in here. We'll see how this is going to work. I'm trying to see how I want to do this. And then this can go like in here. And we've got this little card that can go there. Oh, I know what we can do. Let's make a pocket to go in a pocket. <laughs> a pocket in a pocket. So I'm just going to grab a page out of an old book. It's kind of like an online cracker. Yeah, Penny. That's exactly right. All right. So has everybody entered into the raffle for the glue dots? Raffle for the glue dots. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Dream it. Imagine it. Create it. I mean, I know that, you know, some people give deeper discounts, but I, I'm just myself. <laughs> Yeah, please do not let people know our codes in the retreat. We are all offering something amazing and have amazing prices and items for this retreat. And, you know, we're all individual people. We're not like Michael's or Hobby Lobby that you can run in and use your 40% coupon. <laughs> all right, is everybody in the into the raffle? I'm going to pick the winner here in just a second. I'm going to get a drink of water. I know we have a little bit of a lag.
Another glue dot. It sounds like fun. I think it's going to be a good time. All right, so I think I'm going to a pocket that's going to go in a pocket. <laughs> all righty. Um, all right, I'm going to pick. I'm going to pick a winner. Let me make sure everybody's in. Henry, you're so funny. I love you. <laughs> you better be working, Henry. <laughs> <laughs> I only I only got twenty dollars in donations so far, so you gotta be working selling embroidery work. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna do the giveaway. Is everybody in the raffle? Oops, raffle. Get it in. Ex it has to be all together one word. Exclamation point raffle. One of these days I'll print it on my computer so it'll be seen. <laughs> Laura, do it again. Oh, do it again, Laura. I don't really have a video explaining the subscription in the store, but basically the way the subscription works is when you subscribe, whenever you subscribe, two months from that date, you will be billed again, and when you pay, then whatever the next kit is, you'll have available for $14.99. So it's just an automatic every two, every two months for the subscription box. Bring in the money. No space, Laura. No space. All one word. No space. Exclamation point. No space. Just make it with love, Angel Jones. You're in the raffle. Henry has lunch money. <laughs> you know, we could call DoorDash, Henry, or, or Grubhub, or whatever they are. Uber Eats. Erica won the first one. And then uh, Spectrum won the second one. All righty. So I'm going to pick the winner in just a second. All right. All righty. I'm letting you all get entered in. All right, so I got a piece of paper. Tacos. So I'm going to take this piece of paper and I'm going to kind of fold it over on top of itself where these two overlap just a tiny bit. Uh, I think Rachel has showed this technique before. I've showed this technique. There's a bunch of us that have done this. It's not new. This is also a way to make an envelope. So here's the first part. So this is just barely overlapping because we're going to glue it down on the bottom here in a minute. I'm going to take this edge and fold it up like so. So I folded up the edge. I'm going to open it back out. I'm going to fold down this side. And then I'm going to fold over this side. And while I'm at it, I'm going to go ahead and put a little bit of glue on here. Okay. So we got a little bit of glue. On the bottom where I opened it up, I'm going to cut this at a diagonal here and cut this little wedge out. Cut it at a diagonal there and cut this wedge out. All right. All right. Okay. All right, so here's what we're going to do next is I'm going to go ahead and use my Distress ink and go across this edge. Okay, I'm going to go across this edge. While it's open, I'm going to go across the top edge here. This edge is going to be on top, so I'm going to go across that one. Okay, we following? So now what I'll do is fold this in. I'm going to put a little bit of glue right here. Close this up. Okay. I'm going to put a little glue on the bottom flap and close that up. So now we have a pocket. We have one little pocket. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to fold this up again. 
and crease it. I'm going to add some Distress Ink along this edge and this edge and this edge and on this edge. Okay. Okay. Oh, sometimes the phones are weird. I don't know why it just does that. Um, so next what I'm going to do is I'm going to add some embellishment on top of here. Yeah, you have to have Google Pay set up in order to do the donation. All right, so let's grab, I've got a little piece of lace here. I know everybody likes the lace, so let's do a little piece of lace on that, don't you think? And then let's find, oh yeah, I've got, I've got a little flower. And, oh, let's do, let's do some fuzzy yarn, because these come in the kit too. So we'll just make a little fuzzy thingy going on here. All right, so here's what I'm going to do first. I'm going to take this piece of lace. And that's going to go across here. And I think I want to make this a little bit darker pink. So I'm going to take my stamp pad and go directly onto the paper. That'll give it a little bit of pink across the bottom there just to make it distinguish a little bit different. And then I'm going to put the lace on top. So what I like to do is I will either glue a piece of paper over lace that I've wrapped around to the back side, or I'll take a piece of transparent tape and glue and tape it down. So I'm just going to cut off a little bit here. You forgot about this pocket? Well, I'm glad I'm showing it again so you can see it. All right. See you later, Neppy. Have a good day. I'll probably be still here. <laughs> All right, so that's right there so far. So I'm going to put a little bit of glue on the sides here to glue this down. Does that make sense right there? And then over here. You don't need a whole lot, just a little bit. And then I'll close this up. Yeah, I use the reinker. Um, I either purchased the reinker for my stamp pads, or you can also now get the distress refresher to refresh your stamp pads so they last a lot longer. Okay, I've already got them in, Charlene. I've already got the bundles in my shop. They're there now. I did show them at the kind of midway of this video so far. So when this video is done, you can watch the replay to confirm, but I did show those. <laughs> Newbies don't have a chance. <laughs> All right. So did everybody get entered into the raffle? I'm getting ready to pick it. I know I would keep saying that. So now I'm going to do is take this little bit of fuzz and kind of make a little bundle and... I'm going to put a dot of glue right here in the middle and push that little fibers into it. And then I'm going to take the little paper flower that comes in the kit and stick that on top. And so now we'll have a pocket with a pocket that's going to go into a pocket. <laughs> Thank you so much for subscribing. So glad to have you here. All right, is everybody entered? I'm going to pick the next winner. All right. This winner is going to get the glue dot. So pick winner on soul. Elsie Ann Bean, you won! <laughs> She's been lucky. She won the journal last stream. So Elsie... I'm looking at the, okay, Elsie and Bean, and she got glue dots. So congrats, yay! All right, Elsie, I have your number, so that's not a problem. <laughs> All right, we've got 
two more little goodies. So I'm going to start that again here in just a moment. You won glue dots, Elsie. You won some glue dots. Yay! All right, so one moment and you get to enter a giveaway. Reset. Yes. Glue dots. We're going to change this to hemp cord and open giveaway in consoles. Okay, so the next one, you're going to win hemp cord, and all you have to do is no space, exclamation point, raffle to get entered. And I'll set that right here so you can see it to be reminded. All right, so there's the first pocket, and I think this little journal card will fit in there. That's good. All right, let's see what else we got. Oh yeah, I've got all these tags that can go in there. Yay. All right, so let's see what else I can show you. I've got a long skinny bookmark here. And I've got the Lisa stamp. And let's put her on a block. Oh, that box's not big enough. A little bigger block. All right, and I'm going to use the black graphite. See you later, Leslie. Thanks for stopping by. You're very welcome. I'm trying to, you know, give more little thingies. I know they're not, you know, significant, but I thought it'd be kind of fun. All right, let me see if I can stamp this to where she's on here. Let's do her from the top. So I'm just stamping her on this bookmark piece in black ink. And she's real fast. So I didn't get her really dark. But I think that's okay. And I'm going to take my Distress ink. Kind of go around the edge real fast. And then I'm going to use the right blending tool. Just add some distress ink around the edges. Okay. And then let's add, let's put this Bella Rose on here again. I didn't clean my stamp. I need to clean my stamp. I love the Lisa. Lisa, you should love the Lisa stamp. <laughs> Welcome, Mackenzie. Ah, uh, you love the Fisker stamps? I'm glad you love them. I do too. They're really handy. I showed them at a workshop that I did a couple, uh, last month, and the ladies all went and bought the scissors, and they love using them. All right, so I'm just going to stamp this a couple of times. We're just kind of adding to her. Just something different. And you can have the whole back side to write on. I'm going to add some walnut stain distress ink. Enter the raffle if you haven't entered. Miss the Lisa stamp? That's her right there. Yeah, I'm going to add the darker. That looks good. Okay. Let's add a little hole at the top and we'll make this kind of a tag. Okay. You like that? Just adding, you know, and this is just stamping. I, I like to try to show how you can take just regular paper and transform it. And it can match any kit that you want. And I think I'm even going to go a little step further. And I'm going to take the tattered angels that comes with the kit and we're going to spritz it. Just adding a little bit more to her and we'll dry it. I love this heat it tool. It's quiet.
The junk jar is hungry, Robin says. <laughs> well, Elsie, enjoy your ninja coffee. <laughs> Thank you, Robin. I tried to make it a valuable um, bundle because I thought everybody would love those images that I shared. Oh my goodness, I got stuff all over me, y'all. You want that stamp, the art bar? <laughs> this, the Lisa is not in a bundle. I may do another bundle where I show the Lisa, the Rose, and then I have the uh, Janice stamp. Would y'all like a bundle with those three in it? So she's normally like 1130 and she's 1130 and this is $10. So that would be $32.60 normally. So if I did all three of those for $29.99, would that be something you'll be interested in? Those three together? Yeah. This one's called Lisa. This one's called Janice. And then this is the Bella Rose. Yes, please, Mariana says. Okay, I'll, I'll add that to my shop when I get off the thing here so you guys can have that as an option. It's not a big deal. and just got to make a just thing for it. All right, make sure that you enter the raffle to win the hemp cord, some nice hemp cord, and then I've got a couple more things we'll get out. All right, so I stamp that. So you like her. Um, oh, let's do this. Somebody's sending me a message. So, postcard. We got a postcard. I'm going to grab, here we go. I think that's the right size. This, we're going to make a faux mini postcard. Yeah, yeah. The prices that I'm going to do for the Bella Rose stamp, Janice and Lisa, I'm going to put it for $29.99. It would be normally $32.60 if you bought them individually. Does that help? All right. So now what I'm going to do is I'm using the postcard. This is part of the big set. Or you can buy this by itself. I do have these individual as well. So I'm going to find the postcard. Yes, I will be raffling off the book that I made with all of these tags in it. If you donate cash, then you will be entered to win. Do you make a donation? And right now I'm just doing the raffle on the hemp cord. All right, so I'm going to get my Brilliance ink. And I'm inking up my postcard. So I'm just going to stamp it once just so I make sure. I think I need to put some more ink in my ink pad. So I always buy the reinker. Thank you, Elsie, for your donation. And it doesn't matter how much your donation is to be entered in to win this little portfolio journal thingy that I'm making. That's going to be super fat. <laughs> All right, enjoy your work day. Thanks for coming by. Thank you. Oh, Jan, so glad you're here. All right. Yeah, make sure you enter the raffle if you haven't entered. Thank you so much. I thought it would be a fun bundle. Okay, I'm going to put my head up so I can see. All right, we're going to stamp that right in the middle here. This postcard. All right, and then I'm going to clean my stamp. Well, let's do one more. I think I've got another piece here. Let's do two, just so you get two. Okay. All right, and then I'm going to clean my stamp off. Make sure you enter the raffle. Y'all going to think I'm raffle crazy.
All right, I'm cleaning off the stamp so I can put it away. All right, let's see what we wanna do next. Let's do this. So this looks like a canceled address type thing. So let's stamp it out. I'm gonna kind of put it, well, let's put it like right in here. Yeah. Super cute. Like that. Okay. So I'm going to clean my stamp off again. I'm just cleaning it off enough that it won't get dirty on everything. And then let's put, I think we'll put this across the bottom. Let's just make it all full of stuff. It's going to be like Christmas, Elsie. <laughs> Have a good day, Pink Rose. See you later. Thank you, Mary Key. All right, so I'm just going to stamp this kind of off the edge over here. And we're going to go all the way across. So it just kind of looks like it's a postcard all the way across. Okay. Kind of cool. All right, then I'm going to clean this stamp off. And then let's use some Distress Ink on there. What's going on, Jan? I am showing you how to make different types of journal cards. And we're making a little portfolio. We're having a raffle. And I know February is going to be crazy. It's, co it's already here. So if you haven't entered the raffle, it's no spaces, exclamation point. Oh, you fit. You Okay, here's the pocket. Pocket, pocket, and then this is going to go into another pocket. And I'm making little cards that can go inside. So we'll make it like a little loaded pocket. All right, so let's add some heat to this because I used um, pigment ink. My heat tool keeps hitting the floor. All righty. I'm glad you like your coffee, Elsie. <laughs> well, Marion, I'm sorry you're having buffering. I don't see anybody else posting that they're having buffering. So hopefully it's just a moment of lapse. Okay, I think I think we need to add some pink to that, don't y'all? So I'm gonna put this in the box really quick, like I'm gonna show y'all a quick trick. If you um, slip this, I'm going to lay down my stencil. I'm going to lay down my cards like so. Actually, I'm going to do it this way because I want it to have a up and down. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to spritz. And what that's going to do is it left a void underneath the stencil that can be used part of the page. See there? So that can be a journal page. Okay, I thought it was YouTube because I was like, what is going on? And I'm just going to lay that down and let it soak up on the other page. But isn't that kind of pretty? Wouldn't that make a great journal page? Okay, so we're having buffering all around the world. It's, I think it's YouTube because my internet is perfect today. Freezing where you are. Wow. I, it, a lot of people say it's the weather. I think it's you, YouTube's having issues. All right, so now we just add a little bit of pink, so it kind of has that vintage pink look. And now I'm going to use the Distress Ink around the edges. Is everybody entered in the raffle? Get entered in the raffle. Enter in the raffle. I'm going to keep repeating that.
So what do you think of the postcard? Well, Curry, you're awesome. It's YouTube. YouTube's being a butt. Yes, being, not being friendly. <laughs> not being friendly. All right, so we got some more journal cards there. And I have a couple of tags from the kit. So I'm going to add some distress ink to these. That's Lush Hummingbird Tina. Hummingbird Tales by Tina. <laughs> you like that? All right, make sure you enter the raffle. These are some of the cards that are in the kit. I thought I'd make a whole bunch of little things to go inside. Yeah, isn't it pretty, Carrie? It's Victorian velvet. done so I do work pretty quick so there's some distress ink that I added on there <laughs> I do work fast don't I? I try to unless I get too chatty all right so let's see what we've got going on here we're gonna have this is in here that's in there oh we can put this little one there let's put some fibers on these yeah some fibers some ribbon, some lace. I've got some white lace and some fibers. So let's cut a little piece to go on this tag. Yeah? Yeah, I, I go pretty fast when I distress because I'm like, I gotta hurry up and get it over with. <laughs> You don't have Victorian, huh? I have, at one time, I think I had almost all the colors, but now I don't anymore. All right, so I'm going to show you all a trick. So you've got fibers that you want to pull through, but sometimes pulling fibers through a hole is difficult. So I've got a piece of string here. It's a piece of wax linen. I put the fibers in that and then I'll pull these through like that and then I'll do it again on this side where I grab these fibers and I'm going to pull it through this loop. Because sometimes trying to grab just those fibers is a lot of work and it doesn't want to work. But if you pull it like this, then you get all the fibers through and you just adjust it, tightening it up. And then you've got little fibers on the top of your tag. You know, it might have been, Mary Key, I don't have but two colors of the... Um, oxides. I hardly ever use them because I have so many other inks. So this time I think I'm just going to use a piece of ribbon. Got this pretty pale ribbon here. Giving me a helping hand. Thank you, Angelica. You're welcome, Karen. The, the Lisa stamp's pretty, isn't she, Elsie? I like her, too. I think she'll be good. All right, so now we've got a little tag that we can put right there, and we've got this there. So we've got little things in the pockets. So I think, I think we're getting there. We'll add all of those on here. 
And I think, oh, we got a little one. Let's put this little one in here. Hey, Barbara. Thanks for stopping by. You're awake now? You had to get a little nap, Austin? Well, that, that was a short nap because I've only been on for, what, an hour and 40 minutes? <laughs> You're like me. I can take a cat nap in the middle of the day. Of course, you work nights, don't you? Glad you were able to stop back by. I'm going to punch another little hole. Actually, yeah, I'll punch a hole. And we'll put, we'll put something else in here. I think I've got another. I got some of the string here. So let's do a couple of pieces of this string. So we'll make it two like that. Oh, yeah, I can do the ink, too. My hands, I've got little hearts. It's got gold on it. And I'm due for a nail uh, refresh soon. I've been waiting before I go. Oh, that's okay. Uh, the donation amount, I think it's the same. I think we're still at 20-something. Let me... Henry may still see it too. I can read it off to you. So we had two dollars, five dollars, nine ninety nine, two dollars, one ninety nine, two dollars, and one ninety nine. <laughs> Thank you, my little nail tech. She's really super sweet, and she she says bring. Bring photo, bring photo. I can make, I can make. I said, okay. All right, well, we'll do this. Somebody asked me to do the stamp pad on the ribbon. So if you have a ribbon that really isn't the right color, you want it to be closer to your kit. I'm going to put some refresher on here. Um, you can color your ribbon, okay? So here's what I do is take your ink pad, take your ribbon, and then on a flat surface, take your ribbon and just pull it. See there? So I'm going to rotate it around and do the other side. So I got both sides. I'm going to turn it over and do the back side. And I'm going to do the other side. So now it's taken this really pale ribbon and change the color. It kind of gives it an ombre effect to it. Can you see that? I heard maybe you can see it better that way. Yeah, I, I did my nails this color on purpose so they would match the kit. <laughs> oh, I hope she feels better, Austin. I thought I saw you say something about someone being sick. All right, so oh, let's we got to do the birdie. So I'm gonna add some distress ink uh, in the digital kit, the digital download, and the printed kit. You get all these tags. Thanks, Penny. Yeah, it's held up pretty good. I've only had it for uh, going on three weeks now. I'm about due. <laughs> You like this? Okay. So I'm just going to take this and fold it in half. Stick it through the hole. So it, it kind of changes the look. You can kind of see the difference. So you have all these different types of colors and fibers. Okay. Lots of goodies. Love the bird. Got to have a bird. Got to have a bird. All right. Let's do the giveaway for the hemp. So I'm going to pick that winner. And then we're going to have one more giveaway. All right. Pick winner. Hansel. And the entries have stopped. Mary Ellen Weber. Speak up in the chat. You are the winner of the hemp cord. Mary Ellen. Mary
All right, and you'll need to contact me with your address. Oh, you like to make yours all scrunchy. That works great with um, seam binding. I don't have any seam binding nearby or I would do that. All right, Mary Ellen Weber, you won. So make sure you speak up, and then I'm going to start the raffle here again in just a moment. You're liking all the little tags? Aren't they fun? Speak up, Mary Ellen. Mary Ellen, you won. Somebody type Mary Ellen Weber. Say, hey, Mary Ellen. Oh, yay. Woohoo! Yeehaw! All right. Make sure you message me your um, mailing address. You can do that through my web page, or you can do it through my um facebook i think that'll show up i hope i hope so you can contact me either one i think that's right let me make sure quotes do, do, do. commands oh it's a whole word dadgummit all right so i have to do exclamation point now it should come up. <laughs> Yay! Okay, so you can connect with me through either of those. Just give me your mailing address. Okay, so we'll set this aside. Okay, and we're going to give away, and we're going to reset. Yes, and we're going to have a new one. This is going to be the um, goodie pack. Open giveaway. <clears throat> All right, so I'm going to have another giveaway. And this time you're getting a whole big chunky package of goodies. So you just need to type exclamation point raffle to be entered. Okay. And then if I can get to, I didn't count up my money. So 10. Oh, thank you, Sandra, for your donation. Thank you so much. So we got 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. If we can get to $30, I will do a raffle on this um, and give that away, okay? So any dollar amount, it's fine. All right, so enter the raffle to win this goodie pack. All right, so this is gonna go in here. That's going to go in. So we're making this nice and chunky. I want lots of stuff to go in here. Lots and lots of stuff. Okay. So let's make a few more things with the things that I have here. Let's do something with this guy. What do you think? We've got some pretty textured watercolor paper here. Are you liking these ideas that I'm showing on how to make these journal cards and little tags? I hope so. I hope it inspires you that you're seeing things differently. All right, let's let's do something fun with this. We're going to spray. I'm going to do a mop up on that again. So I'm going to save I'm going to save that. That's going to be a journal page on a journal I'll make. All right, so we're going to, we'll save that one. See how that turned out too? Cool, cool, cool. Yes, Natalie C., thank you. I'm so glad. All right, so I'm getting a couple of pieces of paper ready. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to lay my stencil down. I'm going to put the square piece of paper in the center, and I just covered up the other one. So we're going to do two of them. So I'm going to place those kind of in the center. I'm looking, they're kind of matched up. All right. Lay this on top. So I'm going to use the same Tattered Angels. Again, this is a custom color that I had made um, in my uh, custom made, color made for my sh uh, kit. That's going in this is the I can't talk all of a sudden in the Bella Rose Garden subscription box. 
All right, and the stencil's also in that subscription box. That's the only way you can get this stencil is in the subscription box. As soon as I get the stencil material and do some test runs, I'm also going to start offering stencil bundles in my shop. Um, they'll start in February is what my hope is. So I'm going to save that just for a journal page. And then we got these. Look at there. Isn't that pretty? Okay, perfect. Thank you, Mary Ellen. Thank you. I'll get that. It'll be an email sent to me. So yay, thank you. Oh, Joelette, well, glad you're here. Glad you're here. I hope you're enjoying this. All right, so we've got... I sprayed that and I've got this little design here. Oh, I know what else we should do. Let's stamp the word journal. We'll put this up there. Yeah, let's do that. All right, what'd y'all do with my, there it is. <laughs> I had to find my block. All right, so here's my block, okay. Thank you, Gloria. Um, slogan 413, I think what you can, you can also donate directly through, um, someone used OBS the other day, PayPal, and donated to me. All right, I think I'm going to put journal right here on the bottom. Okay, and then what I'm going to do is... Let's embellish this a little bit more. Oh, and we'll put this one over here. Yeah, maybe. I do have two of these, so I can make a match set. Hey, let's do that. What is slogan? A slogan is slogan 413. Thank you, that Kathy, for your donation. All right, so I'm going to put journal right here, okay? So that's the journal stamp. I've got a pile of stamps over here. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tilt the camera so you can see my journal stamps. See all my stamps piled up over here? <laughs> now do you know why I can't find things? <laughs> Can I put a shout out for 70 Acre Studio, Melissa Bishop, the flock, please. Help her get more subbies. Oh, what's Linda's PayPal? So, you, I think you can do it through... I'm not positive. I think you can do it through that email address, but I'm not positive. It could also be... I think I have both of those. <laughs> Sonia. Okay, Sonia. <laughs> Thank you, Angelica. All right, so let's see what else we want to do here. I think I want to add some distress ink to the edges. All right. Adding the Distress Ink. Okay. Hopefully we're not having any more drop frames. You use PayPal, Robin? I think I have it set up for PayPal on one of those email addresses. I, if I open it up, it causes a problem. And put a shout out to the Art Bar and the R Bar group. They all love you. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. So, yeah, if, if you have a YouTube channel, you won't be able to put your link, but you can say, I have a YouTube in the chat, and people that are watching 
can see that you have a YouTube and they can follow you. And when this video is over, the chat will be visible so people will see it later on and they can follow you as well. So if you have a YouTube, say, I have a YouTube. And don't forget to, don't put, don't forget to put raffle on there. All right. So Elsie says we want to stickle the wings. So we're going to put some glitter on those, but I'm going to mount them first with some fluff. My, my fluff ball is growing. So I think what I want to do is make a little circle of this fluff. So it kind of, I don't know, it reminds me of angel feathers. It's fluffy without it being angel feathers <laughs> or feathers. Because how many of y'all have captured an angel recently to get their feathers? Anybody? Anybody? <laughs> All right. So I'm going to kind of spread that out. I'm going to do another one over here. You have a YouTube. Yep. Tell me if you have a YouTube. Okay, yeah, um, so Robin says we've made it to $30 in the raffle um, to be able to win this little portfolio journal thingy. So if you would like to have a chance to win, you can donate any dollar amount. All right, I think that'll be cute. All right, so let's get this out of the way. And let's glue this down. Okay. I just put a little glue right in the center, and now I'm going to go around the edge. I'm going to put a, a generous amount of glue on here, and I'm going to lay that on top. And then I'm going to grab one of my acrylic blocks and lay that on top to help mush it down. Aw, thank you, Henry. He says, I don't need to capture an angel. I have you, babe, at Linda Israel. <laughs> yeah, well, if y'all didn't know, because I didn't post it on Facebook, Saturday, January the 26th was Henry and my uh, 27th wedding anniversary. Oh, thank you, Lisa, for your donation. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So our 27th wedding anniversary was Saturday. And I had a workshop that I led. And so we didn't do anything until late. And in fact, we didn't even do anything. I One of my friends, oh, thank you for your donation. Thank you so much. Yay, PayPal went through. Woohoo! Sandra L., thank you so much. All right, so... Uh, Sonia, when I say enter the raffle, you make sure to enter, okay? Because I know you donated. So the ways to donate are through the dollar sign that's below, I think if I go that way, below your chat, it's a little dollar sign. And I think you have to have um, an account associated with your Google or you can do PayPal. Sonia, which one worked? Was it the Linda Israel or email me at Linda Israel? <laughs> <laughs> um, so yeah pick one of those and you can send it through paypal as well so then uh i had my workshop all day and then one of my friends was still with me because she didn't have a car and we went to this was kind of fun but we went to um dollar tree tuesday morning and hobby lobby and then i drove her home and she's north of me and since she's north of me i called henry i said what do you want for dinner how about how about fuzzy's tacos tacos are yummy y'all but anyhow he didn't have a taco he had a burrito and i had a salad but i ordered or he had him order and i went and picked it up came home and we ate at home on the sofa while watching tv <laughs> And we were happy to do that for our anniversary. <laughs> All right. So I put the block on there so it'll kind of stay down. But can you see the little fuzzies? Isn't that kind of cute? Yeah. Yeah. So a pastel cat, I haven't seen you in a while. Yeah, I'm now doing um, an OBS software. So I have the camera within camera and we have the giveaway. So if you're trying to put, okay, good. Thank you. So the email me at lindaisrael.com is how you could also donate through PayPal. 
Thank you, so uh, Sonia, for letting me know <laughs> which one worked. So anyway, we had a good evening and we stayed home. So I've got Tulip Dimensional Glitter Paint. Someone had mentioned Stickles earlier. Well, I prefer this because look at the price, y'all. $3.99 and you get four ounces. It does take a little bit longer to dry, but really, I think it's worth it. Um, I've been using this for years. I've always purchased this kind of glue and or paint, not glue, paint, and I think it works great. It comes in different colors. This one is called Crystal Sparkles, so I'll put that on there, and if I want to hurry it along, I can use my heat tool, but that will dry clear sparkly. Well, I'm glad you're back. I'm, I'm sorry you had a, a rough time of it. Yes, this is a new kit that's in my shop now. It's called the Bella Rose Garden, and it's a subscription box. This is not quite glued down. There it goes. I hope it's all better for you now. So thank you, Nikki, for your donation. Thank you. Oh, yeah, puffy paint would be cool. Um, If you heat puffy paint, it gets some neat um, te texture to it. Ask me how I know. <laughs> you don't ever want to breathe in, though, while you're heating this paint, because I, I don't really honestly know what's in some of them, so be careful. All right, my heat tool has hit the floor again, so I'm going to kind of heat dry this just a little bit, just so you can see what it looks like when it's dry. Yeah, hello Tulip. I It's so much cheaper, Elsie, and it comes in quite a few great colors. All right, so that's not completely dry, but can you already see the sparkle on there? Thank you, Dream and Imagine Create It. <laughs> Have some fun. Go get some work done. Hope to see you in the retreat. Thank you so much. You like that? And then here's the other one. I'm going to kind of dry it just a moment. All right. Is everybody entered in the raffle? If you're new, just exclamation point, no space, raffle. Thank you, Tammy. Love this stuff. It's awesome. Okay. So I'm going to set these to dry so I don't set anything on top of them. Okay. Thank you for your donation. Thank you. Yeah, this is this is part of the preview. And if you start the beginning, you'll see the whole flip through of the kit. And then I'll have a video coming out probably tomorrow if I get it edited that shows the whole kit. Oh, no, Carrie. I wonder why. Ex ex asbestos inspector? Uh, no, I don't think we want to be an asbestos inspector. I don't know. If you use your Apple account, I'm sure it does. If it allows you to connect through YouTube. You're very welcome. These are awesome to use. I, I like using I even put an extra fine tip on them so I can get little B spots. Okay, so... Where are we? Oh, I know what I want to do. While I'm waiting for that to dry, I'm going to put some of the glitter paint on here so they can dry. Okay, good. I'll, I'll have that in my shop by the end of the day, Mariana. All right, so I'm just putting some of that paint on here, and I'm just going to use my finger to kind of mush it around so it doesn't have the, the lines that the bottle tip leaves. And it just kind of gives a shimmery effect. And then I'm going to do it on the leaves. Which is different than leaves. <laughs> the English language. The funny things that we say. Words that have multiple meanings. Or when you say them, they sound similar. Of course, if I wasn't an Oki, I'd probably have better... Uh, Diction in my speaking. Yeah, you gotta let the puffy paint dry before you do anything or it smears. 
Okay. Um, refresh, uh, pastel cat. If she's missing, oh, somebody tell her if she's missing the sound, she may have the sound turned off. Um, in this little area, okay, if I can get my finger to go, in this area here where the little sound bar is, she may need to turn that up, or it may be the device she's on. It's okay. <laughs> the email address that works is the email me at lindaisrael.com if you're going to donate through PayPal. And then if you did, let me know because I may not see it. Oh, thank you, Carrie. You got it. It went through. See, isn't that cool how that turned out? All right, I'm going to dry this. I'm going to close my keyboard. All right, is everybody entered in this raffle? Everybody entered? Exclamation point raffle. That's to win this goodie pack. Ah, okay, that's why. <laughs> See how that looks? with it dried what do you think it's not completely dry dry but yeah i i love these a uh, penny and it's such a good a good expense and because this goes a long long ways and you get it you get it in the t-shirt department at hobby lobby and michael's where they have all their uh fabric paint um or you can order it online i have a link somewhere for amazon if you want to order it from amazon but I like getting it Hobby Lobby because I can use my 40% off coupon. All right, if you haven't entered, make sure you enter. All right, so let's see here. We have all these little goodies that we're adding. I think I need to add some more. We have to add more goodies, more goodies. Yeah, gel pens are good. I don't, I don't use very many of them because mine tend to dry out before I use them up. I did buy some new um, Micron PN. Micron, you see that? It says PN. It's a, a, a plastic tip or plastic nib. If you're a person that when you write, you push really hard and you break nibs, this one works really well. I like the way it works. Can you see that? <laughs> to get to the super chat donation link there's a dollar sign click on it and if you have a, uh, a money account attached to your google it will allow you to donate but this is a pretty cool plan i found out about it at creativation and michael's had them on sale all three pack for five dollars and so i bought some so it's a good pen all right so I'm going to add some more Distress Ink. Um, I'll have some in the shop through the 10th of February until I sell out. I had started with 100 subscription boxes. And if it's anything else, I, I don't have a limit on those. It's just the subscription boxes and the creative boxes that I have limits on. Because I only made a hundred of each of them. All right, so this is my pocket that's going to go into the pocket. See all those neat goodies in there? And then this is going to go on the cover. We're going to put these things on the cover. We have a little butterfly here. Let's see. Oh, yeah. And we've got these guys. So they're not dry yet. They're going to go inside. I'm trying to see what else I need to put on here. So I'm going to put this. I think I'm going to put it like that across the front here. So I'm going to put some glue on there. Ah, gotcha. Yours is beside. Yeah, see, I smashed the tips too, and that's why I like this PN, Carrie. You might try it. See if you like it. Yeah. 
Yes, I, I've previewed the kit at the beginning of the stream, and then I'll have a live video, I mean a recorded video that'll go up. I think we put it like that across the bottom. Um, in a couple of days, if it doesn't come up tomorrow. So here I'm going to put glue kind of on the bottom and a little bit up the side, but not a lot. Just to kind of keep things from falling out in the pocket on the front. I'm going to kind of put it down here like that. And hold it in place. Yeah, you can watch the replay and see it. Hey, Denise. You're very welcome, Art Bar. <laughs> Spend your money. <laughs> All right, so everybody get entered into the raffle. Get entered into the raffle. Okay, there's the pocket. And then I know I'm going to put these things in the pocket on the front. Okay, so that'll kind of give some stuff there. And I think what I'm going to do is get another one of these. Move this out of the way. I'm trying to cram this full of all kinds of little journal cards and pieces. <laughs> so again, this is part of the digital download that I printed and then used my silhouette to cut out. I use Aline's Tacky Glue as I scratch my nose. Pardon me. Plastic nib. Yeah, I know. P-N, plastic nib. <laughs> That's why I said plastic nib, P-N. And it's a great nib on there. I like it a lot. That's what I was using to write on here. So you can see it does a new thing. The raffle, you just put that in and you have a chance to win this little bundle of goodies. Yeah, you can ask here. You can ask either myself or Robin or one of the other admins may answer you. Okay, so let's look here. Let's put do I want to do it that way or this way. Okay. So here's what we're gonna do with this. I've got oh here we go. Let's use this stamp. You are very welcome. Oh, good. You get paid tomorrow. <laughs> That's always good. I don't get paid <laughs> unless I beg y'all for it. <laughs> yeah, make sure you enter the raffle. Oh, how funny. It was like Tylenol PM. You only use it at night. <laughs> okay, cat. <laughs> Ah, amazing me, you're entered into the raffle, yay! Okay, I'm just cleaning off my postscript stamp. And here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to use the Victorian velvet with the postscript stamp. I'm going to ink it up. I'm going to stamp it all over. And it's going to be really faint. Okay, so just adding a little bit of texture to that. What do you think? Alrighty, and now what I'm going to do. Oh, I need to use the shabby stitches. We haven't used that this stream. So I have this set. Let me get the right stamps. I have this set of four stitches that are in my shop, and they make like sewing on your project. So I'm going to ink it up with my Brilliance Black Ink. Enter the raffle if you haven't entered. Oh no, you can, if you're, say, here's what you do, Kat. Um, share a project or a picture of something you've made and kind of tell us what you've been doing and that kind of thing. Now, if it's just a share, we have the We Care group where you can put your, this is what's going on in my life posts. But if you want to share a project that you've made or that inspired you while you were having your 
times of trouble, so to speak, um, do that. You know, share a picture of that. So I just kind of made some zigzag looking stitches. I'm going to do this again over here because it didn't quite stamp right. And so I'm going to add some extra stitches to it. So it looks like I, I went over it a couple of times on purpose. See there? Just kind of adding a little bit all the way around. So it looks like you stitched it when you didn't. A lot of people say, thank you, because you've saved me from having to sew. Oh, good, Glory. I hope you like them. Yeah, sometimes a kit, if it helps you make things go so much faster. Oh, good, Sandra. You figured it out. <laughs> You want a kit of all my stamps. I know I have too many stamps. Talk about what you love. We'd love to have that. What Linda said. <laughs> all right, so here we go. I've done that. So now I'm going to add some distressing to the edges. So again, another way to dress up a plain piece of paper to put in your journal. And next month, part of the retreat, I'll be showing how to use your junk mail and make some elements for your junk journals, too. So what do you think? Do you like that? Those are stamps in my shop, Kat. They're called Shabby Stitches. Shabby Stitches. And I have a set of four in my shop. I like the way this is looking. I'm going to add a little bit of distress. So I'm adding the Victorian velvet on top as well. Just kind of gives it a little pinker edge to it. Sometimes I get so vigorous when I'm distressing, my watch thinks I'm running or something. <laughs> hey, Susan! Love all the stamps and the stencils. Yay! The stamps are designed by a friend of mine. The stencils are designed by me. Yes, all the stamps that I use, you can purchase in my shop. I have bundles, I have individuals, so you can do them all. Oh no, you gotta find that long uh, block. I need to find a source. I'm still looking for a source so I can offer these long uh, blocks in my shop. You like that? So you can still write on top. You have the back side you can write on, and that becomes another element to go into this little portfolio of stuff that we've got going on here. Oh yeah, I was going to put, let's put this on top of that. What do you think? Do you want that on top of it? Maybe right here? Or should we do the butterfly? Let's do the butterfly. Let's add the butterfly. How about that? We'll do that butterfly in the corner. I'm doing good, Susan. You know, I'm living the life of a stay-at-home artist. I was telling them at the beginning, we got a new laser machine, so I'm learning how to use it. So that's been kind of fun. How are you, Susan? I hope you were well. Ah, uh, let's see. I do ship to Europe, but to be honest, the shipping is rather expensive. If you go to my shop and click through it, it'll tell you how much the shipping is. And I honestly tell you that it's better if you order more because I can ship it all at one time in the box. And you can also uh, pick and choose things like that. So yeah, do that. And then let's see, Gloria, this time I did not design the images that were used in the kit, but I handpicked the other stuff. So I picked 
the tattered angels. I made the stencil. I picked all the ephemera that is not part of the calico collage images. Yeah. Yes, you'll get the discount code uh, in the in the group pretty quickly. It starts on February the 11th, but I think they'll give the discount code earlier than that so you can order stuff beforehand. And if not, um, post when you when you sign up for the retreat, say, hey, Linda, tag me. Hey, Linda, where's my discount code? And I'll make sure that it gets posted in the group. Thank you, Pam. Hey, so glad you're here. So this is part of the Bella Rose kit. And I think I'm going to add some glitter glue to the butterfly. So I'm just going to use the tulip paint again. And I'm just going to put a little bit on here. So I'm just kind of squiggling it around. And then I'm going to use my finger to kind of smooth it out like that. And then I'll dry it quickly with my heat tool and then we'll glue it down with some goodies on top. So we'll put a little piece of lace behind it. How's that sound? And I think what I want to do is I'm going to color the lace. Dry, dry. So I got a little piece of lace here. All right, let's get my box out. I just love the way these pages look when you have a void. <laughs> the, the retreat, camp retreat. Yeah, Penny, share the retreat ad, email, uh, blah, 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 address, the retreat URL link so people can get signed up for it. And then, Remind me, Penny, to put the discount code so people can see it. So I think I'm going to use the same pink, and we're going to take the white, and we're going to change that color. And then I've got another pink that's part of the add-on kit, but it's a little bit brighter. So I'm just going to do a couple of mists of that. And then I'm going to dry this. Okay, on Facebook, to tag me, you just hit the at sign and start typing Linda A and then Israel, and I should show up if I'm a member of that group or if it's just on Facebook uh, publicly. So that's how you tag me. Oh, Pink Robin, you came back. I know you had to leave for a little bit. I don't, I shouldn't be fuzzing your screen. My screen, I can see the image in front of me, and so it's nice and clear. So, clean your screen, Robin. <laughs> All right, so this should be pretty much dry. I'm going to take this and put it here and do like that. You think that's pretty cute? Do you like that? All right, so we're going to glue this down. So I'm going to put a little bit of glue right behind the ribbon, kind of stick that down, and then I'm going to put a generous amount of glue on the butterfly and stick that down, okay? To find out how much bucks you have, you hit exclamation point B-U-C-K-S. Oh, fun, Ellen. I'm glad she's showing you. Hey, Donna. Glad to have you here. You're very welcome, Sandra. Good luck, Ellen. You can do it. Thank you, Elsie. Thank you so much, Tammy. All right, so here's that. What do you think? You like that? Is that kind of fun? Is that is that doable? Is this something you could do? You know, maybe you have different stamps or whatnot, but, you know, it's just a way to decorate. Thanks, Gloria. Oh, I understand, Ellen. Oh, how funny. <laughs> okay, you shared the link earlier, so people can go back later and look at it. 
If someone else is where they are at a computer and they can share Penny's uh, retreat link, please do so. That's uh, one of my admin moderators. Like that? Okay. So this I'm going to stick in here. So now we're getting, we're getting fluffy. We're adding more stuff. And this one should be pretty dry. So it's going to go over here like that. Okay. And then we've got this one that'll go in here. Pardon me. <coughs> Pardon me. Sorry. You liking that? Okay. So let me do the raffle for the goodies. And then let's see what else I can stick in here. And then we'll do the raffle for this little portfolio of all these little journal cards that I made. So if you haven't entered the raffle, please do that. Yeah, YouTube, please fix the buffering. Okay. Yes, Jolette, everything that I use is in my shop. The stamps, the papers that I use, it's part of the kit. It's all in there. Part of the Bella Rose. The only thing that you won't find is the stress ink. <laughs> I, don't, I don't sell that directly. I have a link that you can get it from Amazon if you like. I can share that as well. If you go to any of my blog posts, uh, when you go to my blog, those links will take you to anywhere that I have an affiliate link. And I greatly appreciate it. If you're going to buy it anyway, I get a little bit of commission and they don't cost you any extra. To enter, type exclamation point raffle. Okay. Alrighty. So let me see. What else can I cram in here? If you haven't donated yet, you still have time to donate to win this little portfolio, any dollar amount. So should I put a pocket on the back too? I think I should put a pocket on the back side. Let's put a pocket on the back. Yeah, we'll do that. You're very welcome. I'm sure it's right. Oh, because that's your video on how to get to the information about the retreat that Penny just shared. So you might want to come back after I've finished this video and you can look at her link. Robin, the bucks are points that you accumulate for watching and participating in my live stream. And in February, I'm going to have an ability of you to redeem your bucks for prizes. I ripped this, so I'm taping the backside. Thank you, Pam, for your donation. So I just taped it. It was ripped a little bit. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. And I'm going to glue that. I'm going to put some the same glitter paint on it. All right, is everybody? Oh, I hope your migraine gets better. All right, so I'm going to put some more of the glitter paint and smear that around. Put some on the leaves. It dries faster, too, if you put a thinner amount on. It reminds me of those vintage cards you used to see that had all the glitter on them. I don't know. I just think they're really pretty. Oh, thank you for subscribing, Donna. Yeah, if you haven't subscribed, please do. Um, I'm trying to get to 10,000 subscribers, and then I'll have some big giveaways, like a Misty and some items from Crafter's Companion and some items from Surebinder hot glue guns and glue. So I'm going to have a, quite a bit of giveaways when I get to 10,000 subscribers, and you don't want to miss that. Okay. Yeah, so I reward you from, for watching me. That's why I do the giveaways and 
I'm gonna have, like I said, products next month. Okay, so this is gonna go on the back. So we need to make a couple of more journal cards. And if you haven't entered that, make sure you raffle. Oh, you finally made it into your craft room, Austin? Awesome. Thank you for your donation, the quilt. Oh, hey, Phoebe. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Phoebe is a friend of mine that I know here in Oklahoma. And she is a long arm quilter. That means she has a big machine that she can load a quilt in and she could quilt the whole top. And I've become really good friends with her. So I'm so glad she's watching for a few minutes. I'm using the printed kit at the moment. This is what I printed on my home printer. So I'll show you what the, this is what the kit looks like on the 100 pound paper on a laser printer and then this is what it looks like done on my home printer with an inkjet it's a little bit different but it still got has great quality even on an inkjet oh i love that ellen uh, she says i found a fantastic book of that is full of pictures and info from the depression area era and it says we had everything but money and that was the name of the book all right so next month i will have instructions that will say to use your junk bucks to redeem for items here's what you do and basically it'll be a code that you'll type and when you do that means you've used your bucks you can see your art room sure that counts <laughs> um. Oh dear. All right, so let's make a couple more cards. So here is a craft card that folds. So I'm gonna fold it in half. Is everybody entered into the raffle? I do print on cardstock, Ellen. I print on a thin weight cardstock in my ink jet or ink jet printer. It does not like heavy cardstock. So I just print it on thinner. You can also submit your print job to a print shop like Staples or Office Depot printing, or maybe you have a local printer to you that allows you to send them your digital files, and you can request to be printed on different types of paper. Oh, your craft room is freezing? Oh my goodness. You're very welcome, Barbara. I know, I have, we have wish what we need, but no money. I, I understand that. Okay, so let's see what we can stamp on here. Let's turn her this way. Let's stamp Janice on there, don't you think? We should stamp Janice. Just so you can see what she looks like. You want to do a video on how to organize a craft room, Mariana? Because I'm not going to be good at it. <laughs> well, good, Kat. I'm glad you're liking it. I'm glad you like it. Yeah. Okay. My craft room is full <laughs> from top to bottom. All right, I'm going to put her kind of at the top here and stamp her. She's kind of real faint, but she's on there. And I think I'm gonna put one of these at the bottom, kind of dress it up. And then we're gonna put something over here. What do we want to put over there? Okay, well, we'll do it this way. I'm gonna take the diamond bar again and I'm gonna stamp it with the Victorian velvet. And we're going to go right on this edge. Okay, so it's real faint, but there's a little bit of texture there. And I've already put distress ink around this. I'm going to put that right there on the bottom. What do you think? I think I'll put a ribbon across here too. More are here. We'll do the, do I want to do this? Like that. And then this, maybe some lace. Let's do the lace. Pink.
place. All right, so here's what I'm going to do, because I want this to be kind of pretty. I'm going to go from the inside to the outside. Oh yeah, I've, I did have, a, I do have a video of my craft room. It's a mess right now. It desperately needs to be cleaned. I need somebody to come help me clean it out because I don't have time. <laughs> All right, so I'm just going to make a little bow on here with this lace. And then I'll cut off the edge. Okay, see that? And then I'm going to put this right across the bottom. Right there. Now, so she's a pretty new in my shop stamp. I haven't had her in there very long, but she's in there. Her name's Janice. Ooh, homemade beef stew. Okay. So now she's right there. What do you think? Isn't that kind of cute? And I think I left enough of a spot here that I have a little bitty tag I saw. And I might... She may be too big. Oh, that one's too big. I thought I had a little one, but I think I misplaced it. Okay, well, we'll make a little tag to go right there. How's that sound? Oh, look, I got a little piece of pink paper here. All right, so I'm going to cut this. We're going to make it one. I got to look at my punch. Have y'all seen this little punch? It's really cool. I don't have it. Uh-oh, Mariana. <laughs> uh, it makes different types of tag. It says one and a half inches. So I'm going to make this a one and a half inch piece. What am I missing? And you're coming, Ellen. You're going to go do my room for me. <laughs> Donna says she'll come and, and uh, do my room as well. Okay, so my piece of paper isn't as long as it should be. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to cheat by putting a piece of washi tape on it to make it long enough to fit. I'll put it this way. So I put a piece of washi tape on this little tiny piece of paper, and now when I stick it into my paper cutter and go down, ha! Looky, I made a little bitty tag, y'all. <laughs> Yeah, definitely join the Friendly Fun Facebook group, Friendly Junk Journal Facebook group, because we are friendly and fun people. I try to use it too. Isn't it a cool punch, Gloria? I like it. It's really handy because you can do them different sizes. I use it differently than what it's intended to as well. Okay, I think that'll be cute right there. And we'll put a little piece of ribbon on it. Babbling too much. Try to get this tight. Okay, there it goes. Love it. All right, so we got a little ribbon, and then I'm going to stick that right here. Okay. 
Oh, but wait, I've got more. <laughs> so in the subscription box, you get sequins. So let's put some sequins on here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the best glue ever and I'm going to put some dots for the sequins. I'm going to put one right here, one right there, and let's put one right up here. And I'm going to do the raffle now. So if you've entered the raffle, we're going to do the raffle now for this goodie pack. So I'm giving y'all a chance to get entered so you can win this goodie pack. Okay. Are y'all entered? I'm getting ready to do the raffle. I haven't done it yet. Oh, good. Art bar, I'm glad. You know, I bought a new printer. I bought one that is the HP Envy photo printer with the instant ink program. And so far, I have not run out of ink because they keep sending it to me and it doesn't cost me anything extra. It's still on my table. <laughs> All right, Laura got entered to the raffle. If there's anybody else, when I pick my hands off this thing, I'm going to go uh, stop it and pick the winner. Okay, good. I'm glad uh, that you like seeing those. Uh, sh uh, Sharon? Is it Sharon? slogan is it Sharon I forgot <laughs> all right so I put a few drops of glue on there I didn't forget it I just let it dry for a moment and then I'm gonna grab my belly jelly stick if I can get this stuff out of the way so this is Ellen belly jelly it's a little sticky product on the end of this stick that you can put in there oh well, hopefully you can come hang out with us more and now that you're doing better, Cat. All right, if you haven't, oh, pick the winner, pick the winner. All right, so I'm going to grab a couple of these sequins. I'm going to grab a big one. So I got a big sequin. We're going to put that right down here on that glue, like so. By letting the, the glue air dry just a little bit, it doesn't seep up through the sequins. I'm dropping sequins everywhere. As bad. There's a little sequin, and then let's do, we may need to do more. Do we need more sequins? All right, so there I put, put a few little sequins on there. You like that? It varies so much. On the instant ink program, what I found was some printers use a lot of ink. And if I had purchased this printer without the instant ink program, I would have been mad because I printed like 20 pages and ran out of ink because they used, you know, full color pages like this. But they sent me another cartridge really fast. So it is of good value. I did the $9.99 for 300 prints, and I haven't even printed 300 prints yet. Um, I'm going to try to do a whole bunch of catch-up prints pretty soon because it does roll over, but it only rolls over so much. All right, I'm going to pick the winner of this little giveaway, and then we're going to start. Oopsie. I lost my chat. Give away, pick a winner. All right, so the winner now is going to get this goodie bag. So I'm gonna get my little note paper. And Sophie Joff, you have entered. You have won, Sophie. S-O-F-F-I-G-O-F-F. -F -F. And she gets the Sophie, you won! Okay, so the Instant Ink program is through HP, 
And when you buy a new model HP printer, they now have the option to do the instant ink. And what that means is you load your computer up uh, with the software for the printer. It connects to a website with HP. You print your normal stuff that you print. You choose a print package. This package could be, I think it's like, $3.99, $5.99, $9.99, and now they even have a bigger one. So if you print a whole bunch, you can do that per month. And then you print your normal stuff, trying to get up to how many prints per month that you want, and you don't run out of ink. Now, the printer may be out of ink, but generally before you run out, you get a new cartridge in the mail. You just swap out the cartridge when it says the ink is low, send the old cartridge back to them and then keep doing this process and it doesn't cost you any additional money for toner or excuse me inkjet on your inkjet printers my printer if i had purchased the ink myself every month it was going to be like 60 dollars per a bundle and for 9.99 i get so much more because they send me three cartridges in one month so i hope that kind of helps epson has a different program I kind of looked at Epson and I was a little bit happier with what I read review wise with the uh, HP. So last raffle. Did we get, did uh, Sophie Minch say hi? Did she say she won? Sophie did not speak up. Sophie, are you still here? Because I don't know how to get in touch with you, Sophie, jo Jeff, if you're here. Oh, that, that is a Embelly Jelly. If you check the description box, I have a link to Scrap Perfect. And this is Embelly Jelly. And I get a commission if you use my link. Embelly Jelly. And it looks like this. So it comes with a stick. And then it has this little thing. And you just and see how much I've used. I've used the same one forever. It lasts a really long time. Okay. Yeah. Okay, Joanne. I had never seen, I never asked if I needed it faster. So it's worked out pretty good. Yeah. So the ink can be really expensive and I'm really impressed with it. Okay. So if she doesn't speak up, I'm going to pick, that's what I'm wondering. She's probably gone. So I'm going to pick another winner because I need somebody that I either already know because I know their address <laughs> or I need the person to speak up so that I can get your address sent to me. So I'm going to pick another winner. All right, so Heather, Heather Blood. So I'm going to scribble out Sophie, or that she didn't win. Heather Blood, are you still here? Heather Blood. Yeah, the ink can be crazy expensive. Oh, I have two, I have two more prizes I can give away, y'all. <laughs> Heather, Heather Blood. Uh, because it's electronic, I hit the button, Mariana, and he picks the winner for me. He picks the winner. <laughs> That's how he knows. All right. Sophie is gone. Where's Heather? Heather, are you still here? Yay, Heather! Okay, Heather, message me your address. You can do it through my Facebook page. Okay, yeah, she's gone. So um, you can message me on my Facebook page or you can do it on my web page. So here's my web page. And then next will be my Facebook. So either one of those, pick one, and you can enter to win. All right, so I'm going to do one more raffle. All right, we're going to do one more. Yay, Heather won. Yay. Make sure you message me, Heather. Okay, so I'm going to reset this. Say okay. And we're going to delete that. And we're going to do... Um, 
this is the QR code. So I'm going to explain this next giveaway. So get ready. Open raffle. Oh, that's good, Tammy. That's good. I'm glad you knew that. So I'm going to do another raffle. All right. And this time I'm putting my thumb over this so no one captures that QR code because people are sneaky on um, screens. But you'll see there's an image here with a QR code and it says gift with video. So here's what you do. You take your smartphone and capture this QR code, go to their website, and then you can set up for free a video that is attached to the sticker and then you can put this sticker anywhere you can put it inside a journal you can put it inside a birthday card whatever you want and then whenever someone opens that up and goes to that sticker and scans that qr code then you'll see the video that's attached so i've got two of them here and we're going to give those away in this raffle right now okay so go ahead and do that I'm going to finish working on this little booklet journal thingy that we've got here. So I've made a pocket on the back and I made a journal card to go in it. And then we're going to raffle this off in a moment. So if you want to be in the chance to win, just donate any dollar amount and you can win this little booklet that I've been working on. I think it needs some more stuff inside. So here's what we've got so far. We've got these three journal cards over here. And then we've got these journal cards over here. So we've got these two. Isn't that a clever idea? I thought it was really clever. And if you guys really like it, then I may start offering them in my shop. That journal card, and this is, has all these little pockets. So it's a pocket within a pocket inside the journal. Okay. Put that there. Squish that in. All right. We got this little journal card here, and then we've got this on the back. So let's make a couple more journal cards while y'all are entering the raffle. Raffle! All right, Robin will be back, she says. I know I've been on here forever. It's been almost three hours. Can you believe that? Okay. Put more stuff in that. I'll do it. I'm looking at my papers. Oh, I know what I want to do. Okay, so we're going to do this. Okay, so we're going to make a little notepad to put in here. Raffle, make sure you're raffling. Uh, the ribbon is, the ribbon, or actually the lace, the lace is in the kit. You get a yard of that in the kit. This ribbon is not. That's ribbon that I used, but that I had in my stash. But this lace ribbon is in there. Thank you, Pink Robin, for your donation. Thank you. All right, so here's what we've got. I've got a, a, a journal card, and then I've got a couple of sheets of these tear-off little notepads. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to distress this a little bit. Your rear end is, but your rear end, what about mine? <laughs> Thank you for your donation, Denise. Thank you so very much. I really appreciate it, y'all. Do y'all like a Thursday stream starting a little bit earlier than noon? I was curious if that's something that y'all liked. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to stick this on the top, kind of down just a little bit, kind of in the center. And then I'm going to use a stapler and just staple right across the top. Okay. And then let's see what I've got here. I think what I'll do is I'll put this little robin on the back side. Y'all entering the raffle? Yeah, a little matchbook in a sense. I'm doing it a little bit different, but yeah, like a little matchbook. So let's put this on the back side. So we'll add some distressing to this.
not me. I'm you're three hours earlier than me, so I'm at almost three o'clock now. You like Thursday, okay? Well, I'll start. I'll start doing a Thursday. Thursday morning. <laughs> Thank you, Aaron. Well, you know, I enjoy what I do. You know, sometimes it takes me a moment to think about what to create. You know, all of this that I'm doing today is on the fly. I didn't pre-plan, really, other than I, per I uh, printed the items so they were ready. I think that's too tall. That won't fit in there. This one will fit in there. Okay. So I don't I don't really pre-plan that much other than I might get my papers cut and printed, um, get my supplies on my desk. I just kind of go with the flow and see what my mood strikes, you know. Oh no, are we buffing? Uh. <laughs> I can do the inking really fast. I love these tools. It's so handy. I watched a lady spend a long time inking her papers one day. And I was like, oh my gosh. Hurry up. <laughs> okay, we buffering. It's YouTube. YouTube is buffering for some reason. I'm going to go ahead and punch holes in these. Buffering. Yeah, to see the whole kit, you can re-watch this video when we're done. Or you can go to my shop. Alright, so I'm going to put a little string. All good now. Yay! Thank you, Henry. Henry's my husband, if y'all didn't know. He's working at the embroidery shop. This little string is in the kit, too. I think that'll be cute. Cute, cute, cute! Let's do this ribbon, since I've got it on my desk. It is boring to do distressing ink, isn't it? I, if I go to a video, a YouTube video, and they don't speed up through the distressing part, I'm like, oh, seriously? <laughs> That's what I do like about the speed control, that you can change that on YouTube and you can fast forward to it. I was watching somebody on uh, Facebook that was distressing, and they were taking forever. And I was like, oh my God, this is killing me. All right, I think what I'm going to do, I think I'm going to do this again. All right, so I'm going to put, take these out. I'm going to take some of the best glue ever, and I'm going to put it right over the staple area. Like so. So I'm just making a little line. And then I'm going to turn this over and put... No, I'm not. I'm just going to do it on the back side. I'm going to use my heat tool and dry it. The box comes once every two months. The subscription box is once every two months. It's $24.99 plus shipping. So it's not every single month. On the off month, I will have something else available that you can choose to opt in or not, but it won't be a subscription box. <laughs> Some people love distressing. Yeah, Robin, this was perfect for you. I knew you loved pink. I knew this was going to be a perfect kit for you. All right, so here's what I'm going to do. I put that ink on the back side. It's somewhat dry. I'm waiting for it to dry a little bit more. But here's what I'm doing. I'm going to stick down this lace on the back side. 
touching that ink glue so it'll kind of cover up the staples just a little bit and then on the front side we're going to tie this into a bow okay like i said you get a yard of this in your kit so use it wisely <laughs> I'm just trying to show you all kinds of ways to use these items. And my hope is, you know, with the subscription box that you use it, that you don't just get the box and, you know, unload the supplies and stick them in your stash, that you get down and, and sit somewhere and put the stuff together. So what do you think? Isn't that kind of cute? All right, let's do one more thing. All right, is everybody entered in the raffle for the QR codes, which I've misplaced now? There they are. Is everybody entered in the raffle? Everybody? Yeah, it there uh, the the stamp bundles are an add-on option, Elsie. So if you want them, you can add them to your um, order. You can message me, and I can uh, add it to your order if you've already checked out and you want to not be charged for shipping. I can set that up. Okay. All right, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take this rose stamp and the velvet, and we're going to stamp it across the corner here. Like that. What do you think? Is that cute? All right, is everybody injured in the raffle? Oh, good, Ellen. I hope you like it. Oh, you find a lot of talkers on YouTube and you find that soothing. I know some people love to come and watch and just hang out. So it's really good. And I can add it to anything in my shop. If you already got your subscription box paid for and there's something else you want added, just let me know and I can get that added. All right, so here we go. Do you like this? Is that kind of cute? You've got this little thing here that you can write on got a pretty little ribbon on the back side you have a little tags you could also write behind there this covered up the staples okay and then this can go right here all right all right are we ready for this last raffle <laughs> Donna says, I need purple and butterflies for March. I will tell you this, that if you like these colors, what goes with these colors, y'all? There's a critter that goes with that. What color goes with these? Thank you for my perfect bow. If Who can guess? what I, the next subscription box kit theme is going to be. If you can guess that, I'll give you another prize. I'll find another little prize. Did y'all get entered? Yeah, Elsie, if there's others that you want, let me know. <gasps> hey, Giovanna got it. <laughs> you are so right. So that's, that's, that's just so you know. I'll get you a little gift, Giovanna, in your package. <laughs> hey, Pixie Bees. Yep, Pam. Yep, Elsie. You got it. You got it. You got a hint. Yep, yep. <laughs> Sandra, you got it. If you haven't done that, pink is this time, Mariana. Next time. Next time. All right. So this is really full. All right, we're going to finish the raffle. Butterflies, peacocks, peacocks, peacocks. They guessed by the colors that I shared. All right, I'm going to pick the next winner. Giovanna, you won. I saw it, but Giovanna, Giovanna, I guessed. A gift. I'll find a little gift. All right. Peacocks. They guess because of its colors, Mariana. 
because I showed him these colors. I said, what kind of thing goes with these colors? <laughs> yeah, I love peacocks. <laughs> All right, I'm going to pick the winner for the QR codes. Oh, you have peacock feathers, Donna? Do you have a peacock? My neighbor has um, an, a neighbor. A, uh, the quilted pig, Phoebe, she has peacocks that live in her neighborhood. So she'll bring me a little flower, uh, feathers every once in a while. Ooh, a chameleon gone wild. <laughs> All right, we're going to pick the winner. Uh, Bunny, did you, uh, did you enter the raffle? Make sure you entered the raffle. Make sure you enter the raffle. Oh, yeah, the, the feathers coming out beautifully. Awesome. You are three feet from feathers? Oh, my goodness. Yeah, just message me if you have any questions. Yeah, Peacock's my, my logo. Peacock's my logo. Oh, and then the uh, I'll I'll tell you that part of the subscription box, the Bella Rose subscription box, there is a thank you gift that's going in all the boxes that has a peacock. All right, we're gonna pick the winner for the next giveaway, and the winner is Christy Como one 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 two eight four. Oh, Christy Karma. My screen was messed up. Christy, you won. Are you still here? Christy. And you won the QR codes. I've I've only seen a white peacock at the zoo. We have one at our zoo. And he's really gorgeous. All right, so Christy won the QR codes. All right, y'all, I'm going to start the raffle for those that have donated while I make another little journal card so that we can close down here in just a moment. You're very welcome, Christy. Message me again so I have your address. And I know you've sent it to me, but send me a message so the message will bubble up. <laughs> Please and thank you. Congratulations. Yay. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to read off Everybody that I know donated, and then if you donated through PayPal, you know who you are. I know there was a couple of them. Um, just say, I donated, and I want you, these people only are eligible to win the portfolio that I've made today, okay? And if you want to donate now, you can. See you later, Penny. All right. Yeah, there's a bunch to, to keep up with. So yeah, message me online if you have questions and I'll try to answer it. I'll be checking my messages here in a little bit. All right, so these people have donated and are eligible for the next raffle that I'm getting ready to start and I haven't clicked yet. <laughs> so I'm gonna reset that and say, okay, I'm gonna change the name to the... All right, so portfolio. And I'm going to do open giveaway. I probably didn't spell that right. Somebody just sent me a message. Perfect, Christy, gotcha. Okay, so these people who donated can enter the raffle. So we've got Denise, Pink Robin, Heather Blood, the Quilted Pig, Donna, uh, nope, not Donna, uh, Pam Emmons, and Ducky Carey. Gillette Edwards, Nikki, Sandra L, Lisa Trimble, Nikki, again, Robin Stapp, and Kathy Lake, Sandra L, Deborah Vick, Elsie Ann Bean, Erica Nelson, Ellen Smith, Laura Taylor, Mariana, and Calico Collage. So if you, I called your name out, you can enter this raffle right now. And only the people that have entered, if uh, someone else enters and uh, that wasn't in the names that I just listed, then I will not let you in. Sorry. 
<laughs> you still have time to donate if you want to donate to get in on this. Just donate any dollar amount. And once it shows up, you can then hit raffle, okay? All right, so instructions clear. Everybody clear? All right, I'm going to get a drink of water. And we're going to make a couple more little things to stick inside here while we're collecting everybody. All right, slogan, since, uh, si uh, since you did, make sure you hit raffle. Okay, I know you donated through PayPal. So go ahead, slogan 413, which is Sonia, right? Sonia? I remember now, Sonia. All right. So let's see here. Oh, I've got something. This is some paper that I painted a while back. And it's just sticking here. Why not? We'll use it. Oh, and I have this piece that I cut up earlier. So let's use some of this. Let's get this out of the way. Quilted pig got in the raffle. All right, so let's make this four and a quarter. Let's cut off this piece. So I'm just taking the piece that I started at the beginning and that was sprayed with Tattered Angels and I'm gonna cut it to four and a quarter by however long it is. So we have these two pieces and then I'm gonna cut this up. I have these two craft cards. Let's see what it does if I go. I'm gonna cut some strips. I'm gonna cut a one inch strip. And that'll be attached. And this is a gel print that I made that I stamped and made a while back. And I'll even stick that into this bundle so you can have one of my gel prints and use it however you want. Okay. That's okay, Donna. If, if you win and you didn't donate, then you're not going to win because I'll just pick another winner. <laughs> if I feel generous, I might send you a gift, but I'm running out of steam at the moment and I'm running out of ideas of what to put in. <laughs> All righty. I'll let you know, Elsie. I'll let you know. I think everybody that entered has, has been a person that's been with me for a while or will at least message me that once I, you know, I can message them. I can't get the words out. All right, so I'm going to add some Distress Ink a little bit to the edges of this pink paper that I just trimmed to be the same size as the craft paper. And then once I finish this... I'm going to pick the winner. So you have chance. You can still donate and win. All right. See you later. Enjoy your live stream. Thanks for coming. I'm going to get off here as soon as I finish this card and pick the next winner. Have fun with your daughter-in-law, Kat. You're very welcome. Thank you so much. I'll have more videos. I'll be live again on Monday. Um, and if there's another day that I'm available, I may do a, a random live here and there. I still have my tutorials that go up on Saturdays. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. I'm glad you're back, Kat. I'm glad you're back. See more of you. All right, so I got that distress. Has everybody entered into the raffle that is eligible? Make sure you've entered. All right, thank you, Donna. <laughs> I thank you for your understanding. I wanted to make that very clear. On Monday at 3.45 p.m. Central Standard Time. 3.45 Central Standard Time. Ooh, lost my lid. 
All right. Oh, I'm glad. <laughs> a, lot, a lot of people love to hear me laugh, you know, and I find that life is just so much better if you're, if you're happy, if you don't take things too seriously and just enjoy life. All right, so we're going to glue this on here. I think I'm about ready to pick the winner. 3.45 Central Standard Time. All right, so we're going to stick this in here like that. Do I need to go through all the stuff that's in here again so you can see what you're winning? I think this one I'm just going to leave the way it is because you could cut it up. You could use it that way. It's chock full of stuff. All right, is everybody entered? That is eligible to enter. Thank you, Donna. I'm so glad. I said, I enjoyed you. I love watching the lives and it helps me distress while quitting smoking. Well, congratulations on quitting smoking. My mother um, died of lung cancer, so take care of yourself. Yeah, I'm going to start doing the Thursday live shows, Barbara. I just started today. So I got good feedback today, so I'll do another one next week. Thank you so much, K Koki. Thank you. All right, so everybody that has done the giveaway, yes, love, laugh, laugh, love. <laughs> All right, we're going to pick the winner. All right, pick winner. Robin. Now, did Robin donate? Robin. Yep, Robin Stapp, you won. Robin, you won. Robin, are you still here? Because I need your information. Robin. Robin, are you still here? You won, Robin. Okay, I'm going to flip through this really quick one more time. Congrats, Robin Stapp. I hope you're still here because I need your information. Are you still here? All right, so I'm gonna flip through this really quick. So on the front cover, we had a pocket and we made this journal uh, bookmark, if you will. Then I made this little bookmark as well with paint. So I'm trying to show you different ways of using things. So this one is using the stencil and adding some ephemera on there. Yay, Robin, make sure you connect with me with your uh, mailing address so that I can mail this out to you. And that was stamping. And you can do that through my Facebook or my webpage. So you can go, let me type it in there so you can have it. You can message me there or you can message me here on my Facebook, okay? Those links are coming up. And then we'll flip this over and we've got more little journey cards. This is where we stamp the postcard. And then we use some of the ephemera that comes in the kit. And then here's a page that I made. Here's one using a gel print and just keeping it lather praying. Thank you. See you later, Donna. Have a great day. Oh, it's terrible. Lung cancer is awful. My mom smoked most of her life. So this one was the pocket I showed y'all how to make. And there's a little journal card that goes in the pocket and a tag. And then there's another pocket on the pocket. And that'll go in the pocket. And then we go over here. We've got this one. And I gave you the scrap. Gave you that. Gave you that. Gave you that. This one we made. I mean, we made all these live today. So you guys and gals can see how this was put together. I'm going to try to take a couple of pictures when I get done. Right, that'll go over there. And then on the back side, we made this little notepad. Okay. So you got little pockets right there. And then here we go is another little pocket. And then you've got this journal card that you can open up. All righty. Uh... It's, ter it's terrible. It's terrible. But my mom uh, died um, November, no, 
September the 12th, 2016. Uh, she had had cancer just over a year and she was in remission, but she ended up having pneumonia. Do share this video if you like it. Give it a thumbs up. Uh, after the video is over, if you have questions, those that are watching the replay, just comment down below or you can go to my webpage or Facebook and send me a message and I try to get to them within 24 hours. <laughs> I try to. I, I stay busy, y'all. <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much, Erin. 2017. Did I say 16? I meant 17. Um, it's It's been rough, but uh, you know we're getting through it. Sorry for your loss. Yeah, cancer's terrible. Aw, you know, it's practice. I've been doing this for 20, well, Henry and I have been married 27 years. So I've been, I've been doing some kind of art all my life. And rubber stamping started about 20, 25 years ago. So I've been doing this a long time. Chris, doing the lives, once I get in the rhythm, it goes pretty fast. But see how fast it was? that we made all these today that if you wanted, you could just sit down and do a session of making all these cards and tuck spots in tags to go into a journal. And then you're ready for your next journal that you're creating. Put this up here. Put this down here. So there we go. All right, well, take care going out in the frozen tundra. I'm sorry for your loss, Barbara. It's it's never the same. And Christy's mom was in September. Yeah, yours was really close to mine, Christy. 2000. It's 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 hard, you know. Um, one of my friends just that I've known for about eight years now, his mother died just a couple of weeks ago, and it's hard. You don't. You expect them to be there forever. And I still find myself wanting to call her up. So I have a couple of friends that I call instead. I'll say, okay, I'm calling you instead of because I can't call mom. And I try to call my brothers too and spend time with them on the phone. If not, I can't see them in person. You're very welcome, Robin. Thank you for being here. Dad in 83, yeah. All righty. Well, I'm going to get off here, y'all. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for being here. Thank you for your donations. And Robin, I hope you enjoyed this. Make sure you message me your address. Everybody else, make sure you uh, message me your address if you haven't already. And I'm going to get ready to stop this. Yeah, mom should live forever, right? <laughs> yeah, hugs to you too, Denise. I know. My mom smoked all of her life. Take care, Bunny. Glad you could be here. Thanks for stopping by. Yep, they're always right here in our hearts, right? They're always right here. You too, Erin. You be happy and be warm. Oh, man. That's terrible. Thank you, Barbara. Bye, Giovanna. All right, I'm going to hit the button here in a moment. I'm getting off here. I'm going to hit the button. You hang up first. No, you hang up. <laughs> it's kind of like, bye, John boy. All right. Well, I got lots to do this afternoon. You've had a lot of loss, Marianne. I know you were telling me about that in, in the past. All right. Well, I'm going to get off here. Y'all have a fabulous day, night, good afternoon, good morning, depending on where you're from. Thanks so much for being here. I greatly appreciate you. And again, if you have any questions or need help, just let me know. Yeah, Henry's probably starving. So I got to take him some light lunch. 